remember sneaking out after dark You to be on my mind all night long And maybe we'd have got a vodka lemonade We show the cool kids how to be the youth of today We jump the fence and play in the Mr. Grogan's pool Hit call the police and we hide behind the school We spent hours throwing stones into the sea They were the best days of my life, I promise thee Oh, I could be a saint while you would be the sinner My mother used to frown when I'd invite you home for dinner Oh, my darling, how I miss you to the day I'd give my everything to see your face again Oh, I'm so sorry I've been distant in the past I've written tons of letters and they'd ended in the trash Oh, my darling, how I miss you to the day I'd give my everything to see your face again, my friend I remember falling so in love with you But your parents packed your bags and moved away Your father got a job in the Empire State Oh, how I wish you stood your ground and stayed behind I've loved and I've lost, but you made me feel alive I guess you got a job, a life, and a family But I promise my heart will always have a place for thee Oh, I could be a saint while you would be my mother used to frown when I'd invite you home for dinner Oh, my darling, how I miss you to the day I'd give my everything to see your face again Oh, I'm so sorry I've been distant in the past I've written tons of letters and they'd ended in the trash Oh, my darling, how I miss you to the day I'd give my everything to see your face again, my friend Sorry, my bad. Mike was on the um, Mike was on mute. Thank you for pointing that out. Thank you, Dan, for pointing that out. But yeah, back to what I was saying. You're very proud of yourself for that one. Really? You're very proud of your joke? Yeah? Very proud of it? Look into my eyes. Very proud of your joke? Good job. Good job. <laughs> I know why I'm doing this. <laughs> Uh, that's funny. <laughs> has everyone been day? Has your day been? <laughs> uh, oh god. Uh, you broke you. You broke me, my friend. You broke me. Ha has he done it? Done what? Done what? Done what? Have you finally broken me? 
Hope not. Okay, it's done it. That's what? Have I, what have I done? What? I turned it in. I turned. I turned in. Oh no! <laughs> oh no! Oh for the love of God, the fanfic! Oh yeah, he did. <laughs> yes, he did. He did do it. <laughs> I was wondering what the hell are you talking about. Oh yes, the fanfic. Yes, he has done it by the way. And yes, I've read it. Well, I actually haven't read it yet. Um, yes, he's done it. He's actually finished it. I am not joking. Hello. Hello, Carl. Fanfic, fanfic. Yeah, Sand Dragon knows, by the way. <laughs> um, also, Carl, what's your p new picture, by the way? You made a fanfic in one day. Yeah, it was actually a very long fanfic. <laughs> <laughs> I think Matt is gay because of the fanfic. Oh, oh, maybe I am. Or was I always, was I always was? Does anyone know? Do you think I'm gay? Or do you think I'm bi? Because, you know, that's also a option there too. Does anyone think I'm bi? Any chance? Do you think I can go both ways? I can totally go both ways. I have the body, I have the body to, I have the body to do so. Look at me. God damn it. <laughs> there we go. Look at the body right now. Do you think I can go both ways? How sexy is it? Very sexy. <laughs> it's very sexy. <laughs> uh, it's not sexy. It's uncomfortable. Uh, it's close enough. Okay. <laughs> uh, uh, but no, I'm not. I'm not gay. No. I wish I was. Oh, maybe I am. I don't know. Never really thought about it. Yes. Oh, right. Give me a second, everyone. Beep. Come on, game. Catch up. Give me a second, everyone. Let me just... Ah, there we go. Okay, dude. Sanctuary is live earlier. I said hi, and he said I was supposed not to be... It was supposed to be private. Did you use their... Did you use their permission? I gave him... I gave Carl permission. I gave Carl permission to do whatever he wanted. I didn't care what the hell he did. Oh no, he's here. Oh no. <laughs> he's here, everybody. <laughs> Look out. Sanctuary's pissed. <laughs> you don't you don't know anything. <laughs> Hello, this is Maya. Hey Maya, it's me. Maya? What what what's up? Why you haven't called in a while? Sorry, I've been busy. How have you been? Well, lonely and it's all your fault. Nah, I'm just testing. I've been great. I'm finally getting used to having my own place. That's good to hear. Actually, I'm calling because I have a favor, favor to ask. Am I in trouble? Nah, you're not. You're not. You're not in trouble. <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> I know, I know. You might... You, you want me to hold evidence for you. Chip, as... Strip uh, as away. There's a lot of buzz about the upcoming trial. I just don't feel safe keeping evidence here. I got, I got it. So what? So what is the t this time? It's uh, a clock. A clock. Did you know Matt and Jane's are pro professionals? Per per personality. Personalities. Did you know? Did you use Matt and Jane's as personalities? I know their personality. I wrote what I had to had in mind. That that's that's a good way. Good job. Good job, Carl. You 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 did your uh, you did your hey Matt um mod moderated duty. You did something out of your mind. I am so proud of you. You did something out of your own head. You know what you deserve? Thumbs up. <laughs> I'm gonna make one. I'm gonna make one up. Okay. Yeah, it's me. <laughs> yeah, it's. Made to look like a statue, the thinker, and tells the time. I thought you might like it. You always, always like toys. Hey, I'm not a little girl anymore. Now, now, you know, I'm only testing. Ah, I should pr probably tell you the clock isn't taking, uh, talking right now. 
No? It's not working? That's lame. I had to take the fuck out. Sorry. I put some paper inside it instead. Knew it. Our top mod, our top fanfic writer too. I knew it. Also, I said the, fan the fanfic that is the professional hacker. And that's I am a professional hacker. Ooh, dude, no way. Papers? Is that the evidence then? Hmm, well, there's a, that's a pro poss possibility that it, it might turn out that, that way, yes? Can you come by the office tonight, say 9 o'clock to pick it up? I'll be at the trial meeting until then. Hello, hello, car. Oh, hello, Dr. Gasker. How are you, man? As Matt sat away from all the chairs, the doc <laughs> at at the doctor's writing waiting room, James comes in. Oh God! Listen, if you want to do a fan fiction, do the same thing Carl did. <laughs> oh. Okay, sis. So I like, oh, excuse dinner. Some something good, like burgers. I could really go for a good burger. Hello, hey DMK. Oh, it's a brother. Oh, it's your br a brother. Oh, jeez. Okay, okay. Well, hit hit the unjoined. Un All right, it's a deal. Okay, just see you soon. Yep, I'll be waiting now. Yeah, that's very loud. Conversation recorded September fifth, night ninth of the twenty seventh a.m. Now, yeah, that's a that's gonna be a big uh, problem there. Yeah, nope. Fair enough. September fifth, eight fifty. Well, I'll read you guys' comments in a moment. Let me just get into the game right now. Hello, hey DMK. Uh, September 5th, 8.57pm. Fry and Co. Lawyer Office. Now, yeah, Miss Fry, I'll take what mine papers. I'm sorry, but I can't give you what I don't have. Miss Fry, you're a, you're a poor liar. Why, I see you right over there. That must be the anchor. That's Followed the papers. His papers. How could you know? Oh, oh, oh. you have. You're. You are not. Conflict. Conflict of my background. Yeah, this is gonna be fun, guys. Um, if you understand my PFP, I just random picture the internet cast typing of burger. It's j jazz humor. Ah, okay, jazz humor. Okay. Gathering information is my business, see. I I shouldn't be more careful. Oh, ho ho. My dear Miss Fry, I am very sorry. But I'm afraid that I must ask you you for one more thing. Your eternal silence. Farewell, Miss Fry. Oh no. Damn. Oh no! I played Division 2, Manhattan, nice. Red, white, and blue. Phoenix Rack takes Ace Attorney. That's right, everyone. We're doing Ace Attorney, everybody. Yep. September 5th, 9.08 p.m. Fry and Co. Lawyer's Office. Uh, uh oh, I'm late. Uh, that's strange. Guess the chief has left without me. She shouldn't have. She said her sister was coming over, so we should all go out to dinner. Very little? No. Is that purple guy from FNAF? No, no. I wish. What's that smell? Blood? Maya, maybe she... in her office. Uh, let's, e let's examine. I smell blood. Can't be good. I have to check. Some... Nothing really. Alright, how do I get out of this detective mode? Um. Ah, oh, here. You go. To the office. Okay, bye. Oh. I'm a fan theorist. <laughs> FNAF theorist. 
Okay, bye. How do I even smell blood? I'm still watching. <laughs> that smell. Blood? Dob? This? Someone's there. <gasps> oh no! He's dead. Chief? Chief? Chief! <laughs> Chief! Chief of the police! No! I had my chance. We had- we were so close, everybody. Chief is dead. We we're so close, guys. We we're so close. We we're this close of going out for someone. Damn it. I will never be a wife. <laughs> uh, we want to go bones or something else. I don't know. Or we're going to bone or something. Something. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> it's her, it's her, who did it? Ah, it can't be her, she just got here. That strange girl dropped, dropped out, uh, that strange girl dropped out cold. I, f I left her lying on, uh, in the office. Went back to the chief, where she laid under the window. Boys. Boys. He's dead. <laughs> hey Matt, have you what? Watch this. It's so cool. No, I'm not, I'm not gonna watch any videos today. No videos today. Later. Also, by the way, everyone, before we continue, by the way, uh, Jackbox Party Night, by the way, with the real life buddies, is on Friday. So I'm gonna organize it on Friday. So we'll be playing Jackbox Party Game with everyone. So if you guys don't want to miss out, it's on this Friday. I already seen it. <sighs> Dude. I can't I can't deny that nice neck clothes she has right there. Her body is still warm. How could you know? I could feel it when I held held her shoulder. Oh. Oh no. <laughs> Phoenix, don't don't break Phoenix, no, don't do this. Then all too quickly it's be begins to fade. Till finally she was cold. Phoenix, no. Boat out my sister. Chief. It's examined. Some shards of glass are shattered on the floor. It seems to be remains of the glass. This is entirely with French with blood. Ugh. How iconic this has become the murder weapon again. Wow, my is, was a league. <laughs> Come on, guys. <laughs> he was next to the body. Come on, guys. The large necklace. Yeah, yeah, that's what we we're talking about. The large necklace. Good, good cover, Carl. Good cover. <laughs> good cover, Carl. <laughs> it's a large building right across the front of the office. The Gateway Hotel, a nice relaxing place. The, the chief's chair. The chief's chair. A simple furnishing thing. Feel pretty good to sit in it too. Well, Phoenix, that's uh, kind of weird. <laughs> chief, it's hard to see her in like this, but. If there is a, uh, any clues here, he was he stuck uh stuck uh, on her head with that blunt object. He probably died instantly. The thinker laying next to her must have been the murder weapon. The thinker has been added to your contact record. Hmm. There's gonna be some glass shards near the chief's body. Must be placed here for glass. Lightly stained. Uh, broken in the back of the room. Hmm. Furry incoming. Yes. Very, very furry. I have a furry feeling on my... <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> uh, yes. Glass shards added to your court record. Nothing else seems like a clue. Nothing else that seems like a clue here. Hmm. I bet someone who was on the title. Simp. Piece of paper. It must have fallen from Mayan's hands. What could it be? Hmm. 
Maxa? The word's written in blood on... A word is written in blood on the scrap of paper. Maya. Maya. Did Maya write this? This piece of paper is a receipt from the department store. Dated yesterday. Okay, good. We know she was alive yesterday. That's good to know. Alright, red, white, and blue corpse. AKA red, white, and blue. You got, you got the joke, buddy. Good job. I think it's enough snooping around for now. I better call the police and find out what that girl was doing here. I think that's it. That happens with a quick slide. Right. I better call the police. That's funny. A few of the screws on the receiver are missing. It looks like someone was halfway through ta taking up, taking it apart. Police, please come in quick. What? What's that? Someone screamed from outside the window. He's staring right at me. Uh oh. He's holding the phone in her hand. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Um. Phone receiver is missing a few screws. Better not use it. This is Fairy Co. Ledger's book. Everything is written in the Chief's unique, neat, ultra neat handwriting. I wish I had a good handwriting. Did the killer go to the store to buy something? True, that could be a that could be a possibility. Keep that in mind. Um, it's it smells it's it's small office, but it makes a good bit of money. Surprisingly, the chief was never good with machines. That all the same use of this PC for picked up the ancient model of that garbage cell. Probably nothing. Probably nothing. Fair enough. Then let's have a look. Ooh, that chair is very. I already looked at it. Phone. Okay, I can look at this. Why would the killer unscrew the phone and not break it? I think he was trying to get the tape. Because that makes more sense. Think about it. Everyone think about this, right? Maybe he's trying to get the tape out of the phone. And the only way to do it, right, is to take out the little SIM card out of the phone. You know that little, like, memory card you have in your phone? Like a US, like a micro USB. I'll show you, because I, if I grab it, it's going to be weird. I'm going to drop it and never find it again. So yeah, you know those little micro USDs? Maybe it's one of those. That makes sense. Ah, ta-da. That makes sense. All the chief department's documents are pocketed in here. This is where she fell her filled her case records and documents. I think that's it. There's nothing really here. I think that's all that we can find. Backspace. Let's move. That girl just now. Where did she go? Oh she's gone. She's out of here. Feels like someone close to her. Well, yes, that is true. All right, all right everyone. We're going to use chat. We're, with everyone's help, we may figure out the, who murdered this poor woman. Gumshoe is terrible at the beginning. Yeah, true. It is some. It is someone we already know. It's a very good point. I put her right there on the sofa. Uh-oh. I hope she didn't run. run. I hope she didn't run on me. Uh-oh. She may have ran. Oh, wait, here she is. Yikes. Don't scare me like that. Um, excuse me, but who are you? It's okay. I work here. Maya. Maya Fry. Maya Fry? Maya Free. Maya. So Maya what was written this girl's name. Maybe I should know her the receipt request. I never thought there would be a use for evidence like this. Outside of the courtroom. Hmm. Wait, go back. I bad. Too mean to that. Uh. I just ate a burger and and went. Okay, the poop. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Awesome. TMI, man. Before my died, she wrote message with her own blood. She wrote it on the back of this receipt. 
that, that, that's my name. Why? Why would she write my name? Please. Just calm down. Why would this write my name? Uh oh. Now I've done it. Uh oh. Please? Sounds like they're coming this way. Freeze, please. Uh oh. Alright, I'm Detective Dick Gumshoe. <laughs> Why is his name Dick Gumshoe? Dick Gumshoe. <laughs> Detective Dick Gumshoe. <laughs> I'm just gonna call him Gumshoe. See? Gumshoe. What an odd name. Tell Maya it was it was up to you later. Yeah, alright, fair enough, fair enough. Received a report from the building across the, the way. I, See? Got personal saying they was saw a murder? A normal name. It's a normal name. I know it's a normal name. It's just funny. It's just funny, okay? Being called Dig is a privilege? Yeah, I know, right? Be right back. Playing detect. Yeah, it's a good man. It must be, have been that woman I saw. Anyway, I don't want to... Uh, I don't want to... Why is he breathing so much? Either of my moving one inch, okay? Great, just great. Maya, wait, she wouldn't have na- Whoa. Excuse me? Eek. This word Maya ha- It means anything- Anything to you? Um, that's- That's my name. What? Uh oh. The victim drew the ne her note in her own blood, see? <laughs> Exqueeze me. Excuse ex -squeeze me. Comedy 100. <laughs> Excuse me. With her dying breath, she wrote down the killer's name. Killer? I'm not. Case closed. You're coming down to the pre precinct, ma'am. What? Uh-oh. Hey, Rush. Maya's young sister Maya was not, uh, was arrested on the spot. I was taken in a, I was taken in for questioning and didn't get out until the next morning. Maya's were heavy, but I couldn't help. I couldn't sleep. I sat around writing from the vis visiting hours to be being at the detective center. I had to talk to Maya as soon as possible. September six, nine oh seven a.m. Detective center visiting. Why would why do all girls have to have that same as in these games? I don't know. Why would like you will like Gumshoe after his case? Pro, promise. Yeah, fair enough. Wow, that has more. Wow, they have poor Maya locked up like a criminal. Oh, oh, it's you, the lawyer. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Hello. She looks tired. Oh, I would too. Spooktober is around the corner, Matt. I know. I'm downloading Outlast. I'll download um, Outlast. I'll download Outlast and stuff soon, though. I'm going to be downloading a lot of stuff tomorrow. Yeah, that's right. Spooktober is around the corner, guys. Get ready for this. She looks so tired. Um, Are you going to be my attorney? Well, that's what I want to talk to you about. It's up to you. Of course I will. Sorry, not not a chance. Not a chance. Alive, alien, isolation VR. I'll try. I'm not gonna keep any promises, but I'll try. <laughs> of course I will. First things first, but better get her to ch cheer up. Yeah, of course I will. Sure. Really? Whoa, did I say something wrong? Something wrong thing? She looks sad and now. Um, what? What's wrong? You didn't think I can do it? That's why, mod. It's it's a mod, that's why. Mod, yeah. It's a mod foe, though? Yeah, I know. I'm not gonna keep any promises, though. No one would cut cloud. Um, I told you it's up to you. Nope. Who would believe me? Even you, when you find found me in the office, you looked at 
be like I ha I have done it. Did I look at her like that? No, no, I never fought. The guard behind that looks menacing. Yeah, the guard behind. Yeah, look at him. He's 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 menacing looking at that wall. Look at that man. He has the death stare against that wall. He wants to beat up that wall. He's like, man, when I get out, man, when this lady leaves, I'm gonna beat the crap out of this wall. I'm gonna escape this prison. He's just staring, staring there menacingly. Yeah, he's menacingly looking at this wall. He really wants to beat up this wall, but he knows if he beats up the wall, he's gonna get fired. No, no, I never fought. It's okay. I understand. And I've also heard about you. Heard? Heard what about me? I was talking to my sister on the phone the other day. Oh. Today was my junior pretense first time in court. Really? How's that? How'd that go? It was quite the scene. Honestly, I was on the edge of the whole time. It was been a while. Now, so he's he crushed and any he, he's any he crash and burn. He's a genius. Matt's simping so hard. Of course I am. Right? Look at that necklace. Of course I am. It's a very well made necklace. Jeez. All right. Of course I am. There you go. Once of those strike fears into the heart of the evil types. The only one he lacks is experience. She's simping. He's she's simping so hard. She's simping too much. She's ultimate simp. <laughs> how how do you how do you people today how do you uh, how do you people today we get to play Fortnite on my stream? If you hate the game, do you? Do not join the stream. I don't know why you I don't know why you're putting it on my chat. <laughs> you can say it on your you can say it on your stream, man. Uh sounds like it was fun. Well, I know who to go for if ever get into trouble now. I don't know, Maya. I think you might want to wait. Give him three more years. That's it. Unless you want to be found guilty. Uh oh. That's what she said. Oh, okay. I don't have Fortnite. Same. I don't have Fortnite either. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to insult you. No, it's okay. It's true. It's true, I guess. But at the same time, I can't just sit by and watch. When I think of the person who did this to Maya, I know. Ah. Uh... Maybe I can show the statue. I want to ask you about this murder weapon. Poor sis. Hmm. Better not ask her right now. Uh, this broken remains of the glass light stands broken. Okay. I thought she'll know something about the statue, so we can ask her. But I'm guessing not. The broken glass remains. This is laying next to the chief's body. I saw that too. He said that they thought those were pieces of of a light, of a broken light stand. Yeah, that's what it seems like about that, right? Those never heard of glass light scenes before. This everything. By uh, the day of the crime. Did you tell me about the day of the murder? Yes. Oh, wow, well, that's that was quick. Everything. Uh, Maya is holding a secret. She's not the killer, though. I know she's not the killer. Yes. Let's see. That morning, I got a call from my sister. When she went, she wanted me to hold into a piece of evidence for her in the upcoming trial. Evidence? Yes. That clock shaped like a like the finger. That what the one Larry made. I could that have I could that been evidence in that case. Um right. She said something about that. I remember. Do you want to hear it in her in her own voice? Her own voice? Yes. I'm pretty sure our conversation is on a is on my cell phone. 
You recorded it? Yeah. I forgot how to delete those things. Okay. Your phone call? You said you, so you said you have a confession with your sister on the phone, cell phone? Let's hear it. Right. Oh. I just remembered that text took my cell phone. Sorry. Oh, right. Of course. Next time I see Detective Gumshoe, I'll ask him for it. I'll write you a note so you don't forget, okay? Sure, thanks. Why is Memento added to the court record? It is... Maya's holding secret, she's not the killer, I know. Is it the balloons DL6? Nice that you need it. <laughs> nice. That's all you need. There's something I have been waiting to ask you. That's, what's, what's with the outfit? Oh, this? This is all the Arakro wear. Akoloi. Uh, kawaii wear. <laughs> it's my uniform. You could say. A Akoloi? A Akoloi? A kawaii? Oh, I can't even speak it. Like people in the regional training? Re regional training? What is that you do? Oh, it's nothing. It's really? I'm a spirit. Spirit medium. M middle. Medium. Training. Spirit medium? Pretty sure that qualifies as strange. Spirit medium? So you can uh, actually a med in medium in training? That's right. That's Frey family. Especially the women who have always been very sensitive to the spirit world. Wait a second. You said the Frey family. So Maya was into this stuff too? Of course. She left a, mo she left a mountain to do. Followed her case, she said. Her powers were first class too. I had no idea. Hmm. Wait. What? So you're real honest to got to goodness spirit medium with ESP and that's it? Cool. The DL6 included? I don't know. I think so. We'll, we'll see. I don't know. We'll see. Yes, I'm in, in training. Well, not... Can't you contain, contain Maya's spirit then? Contact Maya soon. We can just ask her who killed her. I'm sorry. Oh. I'm still in training. I couldn't do something on that level. Hmm. But that would have been easy too. Hmm. Ah, something the matter? Uh, I was wondering, could you, I ask you for a favor? This is the... This is the address of a famous lawyer. My sister gave me this long time ago. He said it, if I was ever in trouble, I should call him. And well, I am in trouble. Do you think you could go and ask him to represent me? Hmm. Sure, we'll do it. Sure, why not? I'll go ask. Thank you so much. That's Edworth. I think it's Ed Edgeworth too. I have one... I, I have no one else to turn to. Say, what about your parents? Uh, she, they're dead. <laughs> I, I see. I don't worry. Leave it to me. Thank you. The trail is tomorrow at 10, 10, 10, 10 o'clock. Wait, what tomorrow? Tomorrow. What if this guy refused? They told me that if you, I don't find one, the state will pick an attorney to defend me. When will that happen? They'll give me it till 4 p 4 in the afternoon. Visiting hours is almost up. I better hurry. Right, I will be back. I guess that's it. I think that's it. Can you tell me about the day of the murder? Sorry, I don't know much, much be hard. I know it'd be hard. No, it's okay. All I've been doing the last few hours is think talking about it. I kind of got got used to it. Let's see, that morning I got a call from my sister, she wanted to hold up on the 
Okay, yeah. 9 p.m. The lights were off. I couldn't could smell blood. And I found her, my sister. I think I already done this before. <laughs> Thanks, Maya. That's all I need to hear. I shouldn't skip that because I was goofing. Edworth killed his own father. Lol. Wait, what? Uh, I guess that's it. Let's move. Uh, go to the Memphis office building again? Yeah, that's what I'm doing. Fry and co-lawyer. The office is filled with places. They're all busy sketching. Hey, you dare. This is a crime scene, pal. No trespass. Um, sorry, I don't... Sorry, don't I know you from somewhere? Wait, you're the buzz guy. You? No, 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 no. Phoenix Wright. How could he, anyone mistake me for Larry? Ah, guess I've... I guess I got those wrong names, Mr. Wright. Sorry about that. The buzz guy, he was killer. And you're no killer, right? He was... He was proven innocent. Oh, right. And you were... You're a detective gumshoe. Gumshoe. Wasn't it? Dick Gumshoe? Right. At your service. Hang on. Detective Gumshoe. You... Pal. Anyway. Get... Get the name right. And don't... Go call... Don't... <laughs> and don't go call me Dick. Hey, Dick. Get over here. <laughs> Please, over. Hey, Dick. Get over here. Yes, sir. Be right there. Um, hmm. <clears throat> You're her lawyer, right, pal? If you are going got business here, you better do it quick. You. He thinks I'm Maya's lawyer. <laughs> hey, Dick, come over here. Um. Maya's favorite part of the plan. I remember it. Yeah. I remember it had this bizarre name no one could remember. <laughs> kind of a strip, pal. Who is that? The sky is blue, and so am I. And there's that hotel right across the way. I'm guessing that's it. Why is desk? Perfectly clean, as always. The only thing it's missing is my. Imagine his sister be like, I'm gonna hug you so hard, Dick. <laughs> oh my god, Carl. <laughs> That's great. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> and, and a movie poster. Fearing that was the first movie that Maya made, made Maya cry when I saw it. I had to check it out one day. There's no. <laughs> uh, the horrible amount of le legal ledge of book. Seriously, there's still Maya probably read all of these. Okay, let's get back. Let's go talk to Dick. Um. Oh, maybe we can do this. I was wondering, did you see Maya's Fry's phone call? Oh, that. I have, I have that. Do you think I could have it back? Sure. I mean, wait a second, pal. Tricky lawyer. Uh-oh. He's on to me. Tell him straight. Tell him I'm not, not so strong. strong. If I tell him I, why I wanted these, there was no way he'll give it to me. Something is the matter. Oh, no. It's just, you know, detective. Nope. I know nothing, pal. Phone call has a lot of numbers on it. Like her boyfriend. If a call phone... A cell phone holds a little girl... Little girl sweetness. Spicy Ugh, oh, they're trying to confuse me. Sorry, pal. I've already checked all the numbers in the... Impressive. You're quite the detective. Uh-huh. Go to the getaway hotel? Oh, we'll do it in a moment. Uh-huh. Oh, 
here, you can have the phone back. There was any suspicious calls records in there after all. Seems he didn't know for recording. When I cell phone received from the technician. Check in the court records here to record recording conversations. Means he doesn't notice the recording on the game. Okay. Uh okay, let's uh let's just go back. I don't think I can I don't think I can ask him for anything else. Hmm. What's that? Sorry, pal. But that but I get no info like Okay. Hmm. Who showed him this? This is a piece of paper next to the victim, wasn't it? Yeah. The one that ha the killer's name was written on it. Are you sure that Maya wrote it herself? Given the color of the writing, it's hard to say if it's her handwriting or not. I will in a second, okay? Give me a second. I just want I want to talk to Gumshoe for a moment. <laughs> Hell is that? <laughs> so there's no proof that Maya wrote it. It was a broken glass at the crime scene, right? Hmm. Oh, that. It seems like the glass stand next to the victim all over. The glass shards were pieces of hand. I was wondering, do you know anything about this? That statue? That's the murder weapon. Ah, he thinks the clock is just a statue. I'm starting to wish never seeing... Okay, wait, right, so it's not, he thinks it's a clock, so I'm guessing that's not going to help us out at all. Um, oh yeah. That Miss Fry, did you know, did you do anything, did you do an autopsy? Um, you want to know the results, huh? Now, don't you look at me like that, pal. It's not, it's not you, it's no use. She might have been... I uh, have been your boss, but that doesn't mean you get any special treatment. Alright, alright. You can see the report, but that's all. Well, that's good, I guess. Miss Maya Mills? Yeah. Miles Mermer. Miles Mermel. Mela Miles? Maya Mayer. Mayel Mile. Say to the detective. Say to, to the detective. Oh, okay. Um, about Maya. Yeah, I'm looking forward to the trial. Sorry, Val, but this is the one trial you ain't going to win. Why do you say that? The city is pro protests for security. Edgeworth on the prosecution. Edgeworth? I'm sure you know what it means, being a lawyer and all. I guess I've asked the questions I all done, pal? Uh, yeah. Thank you. I've been holding out... No. Out. Oh, wait. One more thing I've wanted to mention to you. I... Ah. Miles Edgeworth? Yeah, I'm gonna figure that out. I don't suppose you planning on talking to the, that witness. Anyway, you better not. No inf indication to Swift. Lawyer's way, pal. Come to think of it, come to think of it, I had completely forgotten about her. There, there's the, the witness? Yeah, this April. Hey. I'm sorry about this, but I can't tell you anything about her. Well, just told me her name, Miss May. So you sent her home already. Uh huh. You're trying your lawyer tricks on me now. Good, forget, forgot about her name. She is, she's freaking fairy. <laughs> yeah. She's not going outside, outside of her room until the trial. So, she's still in the hotel across the way. I guess I shouldn't, I guess I shouldn't know better than to try to get detective of lack of information. You got that right, pal. Time to tell, time to visit. Uh, time to 
pay a visit to Miss May. Prosecution Edworth. That's right, pal. Miss Miles Edgeworth himself. Wait, you know him? Don't, don't you? Of course I do. Of course not. Ah, uh, do I know him? I think so. Of course I do. I know him. He's fear, fearless prosecutor. He doesn't. He doesn't feel pain. He doesn't feel anger. He won't stop until he gets his guilty verdict. Hey. Ah. Don't you talk about him that way. You made. You make him be brutal sounding human. Still, I'm afraid this pretty much defies this case. So, Edgeworth is on this one. He hasn't lost a case since he became prosecution at the institution at young age of 20. Of course, there is a rumor of black alley deals and forget, forget evidence. All I know for sure is that Edgeworth hates crime with an almost abandoned profession. I have never imagined I was facing him so soon. Okay, cool. Go forget about her. She's... Um, I think I've done everything I need to here. Uh, I don't think... Okay. Um, how do I... How do I leave? <laughs> there we go. Um... Ah, oh, great. Now I'm gonna go to the alert. Move to the hotel? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking next. September 6th. Gatewater Hotel, room 303. Well, hello there, handsome. Oh god. Uh, hi. Smooth. Smooth, right? Real smooth. Oi. What? <laughs> You're the lawyer, ain't you? The detective told me. He said don't say any say nothing to the lawyer, pal. Tee hee. Mem memo to self. Remember to self, thanks Detective Gumshoe for making my job harder. Gee, this is all the things something to get out, something out of a movie. It's all exciting, I can't handle my con- Contact myself. Oh, let me go freshen up and so I can look at a part of the little witness. I pretty- it's- I pity the lawyer that has to cross-examine this one. Probably me. Pink hair, you look like an eagle. Yeah, pink fast. Throw bread. What the heck is that? Is that a screwdriver? There's a screwdriver stuck in the drawer. I wonder if what's inside. Let's take a look. Hey, 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 hey. What are you doing? No touching. Oh, bad boy. Oh, God. You really shouldn't pay, pry around in other people's rooms now. You would want to make up. You uh, do you want to make me upset? Would you upset? I thought she was going to explore for a, sec for a second there. I wonder if that that what well, I could be inside the. Hmm. No, I am not. <laughs> I'm naughty, Miss May. If you, if you, <laughs> I think you're a fairy. <laughs> Or furry. Yeah, I can tell why. These flowers are fake. Expensive. It's sunflower. Sunflower and tr turnip. Tulips. But that's all about the browse here. Ah, the ceiling painting. Wait, shouldn't that be still alive? Whatever. Once those hanged on the wall. Simple bed. It's been re remain nothing a ca eye catcher. The late summer sunlight streams through the window. There, Miss Fry and Co. Lawyer offers building, of course. You shouldn't have seen. You couldn't have seen inside from the room pretty clearly from here. I think it would be a little difficult to recognize a face from 
Nice. Okay, fair enough. Okay, let's see. Uh, I don't think you have. I don't think you have any idea of these. So I'm gonna talk about this. Excuse me, but I'm a witness, police witness. Understand? I could. I possibly give you any information in good context, and maybe the witness. It's just like in the movie. Right. Um. Well, guessing I had to talk to her. There's no way I can't do any evidence. I don't think Miss Furry is the killer. I don't think she is either. Yeah, yeah, Sim. What you witnessed? Do you think you could tell me something? I need to describe what object is crime is case. Oh, absolutely incredible. You sound like just like a lawyer. Maybe it's I like a man with a big vocabulary. Hmm. Yep. Better not in encourage her. <laughs> you know the thing, the ocean, uh, happening to the other day, the bad thing? What did you see? What, ha what happened? I suppose to, I didn't suppose you couldn't tell me about it pretty quickly. Let me see. Ah, uh, well, dream on. If you want to know, you'll just have to come to the court tomorrow, Mr. Lawyer. Oh boy. This way, man. Uh, could you just... Who examined exactly are you? Oh, Mr. Lawyer, are you hitting on me? Oh, here we go. No, no, hey, I'm just doing my job here. Hee hee, you know you're cute when you blush. Believe me, this is the first time in my life I have blushed in this much. Hmm. Why is his. Why has all the girls with. with. <laughs> It is like Phoenix. I don't know. Maybe because he's hot. I don't know. Look at him. If she's so she's if she's too stupid to become a furry, that means she's a you can't kill a person because of how stupid she was. Yeah, true. Right? Can you just tell me what it is you do? Is it you do that? Well, no, Tihi. And you had your little hopes up, didn't you? Oh boy. This room. I've seen these, this, there's uh, two glasses table. Is someone staying here with you? Oh, what amazing powers of observation. You must have been one of those famous detectives, like on television. Oh no, not me. I'm uh, just a lawyer. Hey, Mr. Big Detective, why don't you, why don't you go look for clues in the garbage? Mm -hmm. Miss May doesn't like Nasty little lawyers. Oh boy. That's it. She's she's not going to give me any information. There's no way. Like, that's a problem. She... Maybe she saw this. Excuse me, but I'm a witness. Please... Well, that... Guessing that won't help me. She said she liked men with big vocabulary. That is true. But I don't think there's anything else. When YouTube is re when is YouTube rewind twenty twenty? Probably never gonna happen. Look at the previous YouTube rewinds; they've been terrible. They're like twenty fifteen. That was quite good. Oh, I gotta go to the lawyer's office. PlayStation. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah. Ace Attorney in a nutshell. Hmm. <laughs> hmm. Seems like Mister. Crossbird is out. Well, maybe I should just wait here for him to come back. Um, if it wasn't the most over-to-top clearing of the throat I have ever heard. Aha, uh -huh. so you so the one they said to has been looking for me. Ah, uh, yes, that's me. He looks even grander than I imagined. Hmm, that's, that's badger of course. Your collar. Yes, yes. Uh, you're you're the lawyer, are you now? Uh, so you're a lawyer now, are you? Yes. Well, yes. And what do you want? I'm not supposed to be personalizing business these days. Please proceed. Not busy. Then how come no one could get in touch with you? Hmm. Yes. Yes. Hmm. 
Yes, yes, very, very interesting. Dr. Eggman? Yeah, <laughs> I, I can see that. Hmm, yes, yes, hmm, yes. Yeah. Wanna play? Who wanna play black, <laughs> black Jack with me? Nah, it's a, it's the co his cousin, Jack Black. Black Jack with me? Hmm, something the matter? You could to see the one and only Mavius Grossberg, did you not? Well, here I am, boy. What do you want for out of? Um, I'll play. Looking at the painting behind the me the meeting. Looking at the painting behind the meeting? Yeah. Well, here I am, boy. What do you want? Uh, I should give him more be better voices than my own. Hang on, guys. He's, he's in the middle of Australia? Yeah, that's what it is. Well, here here I am, boy. What do you know what... <laughs> Take it. What went out with it? Um, oh, uh, well, sir. Actually, that Maya, Maya Fry... Hmm. It's Gar Gra Grossberg? Oh, it's Grossberg. Pretty obvious so far. I can see why. Uh, yes. May Fry go on. Hmm. Why is this strange reaction? Uh, chit chat. I'm really quite busy here, son. I can't go taking cases on one day notice. Not. No, quite. It's not quite impossible. Wait a second. How did you know that trial was tomorrow? Uh, huh. If there any f other characters, it's Grossberg. Yeah. Uh, um. Anyway, I'm afraid the eternal is impossible for me to re respond. Uh, sorry. End of discussion. What's going on? He refused me before I even got the chance of to ask it. Alright, what's I'm doing it wrong? What do I tell Maya? Actually, I don't want to, I don't want to show him any evidence because I think that he'll use that against me. You're you're refusing? How can you just refuse like that? Please tell me. Why would you take this guy? Why take this guy? <laughs> uh, well, you see, it's just I'm busy. You see, pick every option. I'll try, but every client is May Fry's sister. Um, <clears throat> May I trust you? She knew her sister would be in good hands. Yes, yes, of course, I know that. However, I'm sorry about. Must be. I must refuse. Sorry. Goodbye. Creep. Fine. I don't have time to agree with your anyway. I'll go look somewhere else. Grumbling. Think not. Huh? Did you say something? I think not. I said. Wait. Wait. What? What do you mean? What do you mean? I'm terrible. I'm terrible. Terribly sorry. But I'm afraid there is no lawyer worth their salt to will take on this presentation tech case. Terribly sorry, my boy. Why? I I cannot say. I beg you, Proden, Proden, Proden. Eh, but couldn't you leave now? And I've nothing more to discuss with you. What's going on here? Okay, let's let's show him the evidence. Maybe he'll know something. Okay, I can't. Oh, with Prissy. Very sorry, but I've got nothing to say during this matter. Very sorry, but I have nothing I can. Very sorry, okay. Very sorry, okay. Very sorry, okay. Very sorry, okay. Very, he's not gonna give me any information. That's how. Maya. How do you know Maya Fry? She worked here a long time ago. Quite apparent, that one. Letting my bequest in the blink of an eye. She left one day, quite suddenly. She had a mission, you see. A mission? You could see in her eyes. She followed it with a burning passion, never locked, looked back, that one. Okay, the painting. 
That's a quite of a painting. Um, you noticed. It's, ah, you've noticed, sorry. It's my pride and joy. Impressive, isn't it? Well, isn't it? The color of the sky, the hue of the sea, and the waves of the straw hat. That's a lie? Yeah. I can tell that's a lie. It's worth at least three million. I have no interest of parting with it, of course. No, I wouldn't I wouldn't sell it, not even to you. I wasn't interested. This is that's not for sale. Yeah, I'm not I'm not buying it, jeez. She left to go to the chief when she left home, not job. Oh. She left to go to the chief when she left home, not job. For reasoning for some reason, this game is like more complex than LA Nor. Dude, it's like an LA Nor. Go look around his office, see what he uh bookshelf. Uh, hmm. Funny. They don't look like they've been read. It's full of monocle desk. Marble my my a solid mahogany desk. The wood's been polished to the deep layer. The table of cigar of clients. He's an intelligent employee case and I'm not mistaken that lighter may made of solid gold. Even I would tell someone he he's got money to burn. Lol. Yeah. I examined the pot of plant. No idea what kind of plant it is, but it's probably the most expensive one available. This painting has been bugging me ever since I stepped in here. The oil paint is so thick, it's practically giving me a stuffy nose. I'm not sure the price is nothing to sneeze at either, or that matter. I'm guessing that's all the things I can find in this room. Okay, back up. I'm guessing, I'm guessing I've already asked him everything I needed, so he's not really any help for me. Alright, whatever. So I'm guessing that's it. I gotta go back to September 6th, 3.42pm. 3 Hiya. Oh, you're back. Did you find the lawyer? Um, well, what do I tell her? Well, you see, just be honest, I really don't think you should use that guy. Uh, I didn't see him healthy. He seemed, he was like all skin, all, he was all skin and bone. What really, what happened? You don't mean he refused to help. Uh, I see. I've been abandoned then. Your family. What about your family? I'm only ha- I only had a, my sister. My father died when I was very young. I am playing Fall Guys in Matt. Uh, Fall Guys right now, Matt. Oh, okay, cool. Nice. Nice, John Pauls. Nice. John Paul Zimmerman. Nice, nice. And I know where... I don't know where my mother is. I don't know. She, so she couldn't still be alive. Your mother? The woman is in my, in my family. I haven't been the sake of the generations. They said lottery spilled a pot. How runs in our blood? John Paul, Roblox noob? Oh, John Paul is Roblox noob. Oh, is he? Well, there you go. Oh, there you go. I'm playing Snake, Snake, Snakey Bus Run. Oh, that actually makes a lot more sense. Fair enough. About 15 years ago, our family was involved in a incident. There was a man, man, and he 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 ruined our, he ran our mother's mother's life. He ruined our mother's life. Ruined? After that, she disappeared. Several years after that, my sister announced she would become a lawyer, and she left the left for that moment. So you like so you lived by yourself? Yes, I've I've got used to it. 
Oh, also, I had become in independent, or I wouldn't lose. I will lose my power. Jesus Christ! I know. I feel like I feel so bad for her. All by herself. All by, uh, all by herself. Herself up on this moment. I didn't help at all. Maybe because she was focusing on her lawyer stuff, then she couldn't have time to do that type of thing. So it depends on how you look at it. Mother had enemies? So, who was the man who ruined your mother? About 15 years ago, there was a. It was unusual. Better case. It made quite a stir. Everyone was talking about it, apparently. The police were running out of leads, and they were getting desperate. Wait. They didn't use a script, script me medium, did they? The police conversed on my mother's to try to tend to the victim. Wow, so what happened? The case was solved. We fought. Fought? The man, my mother, the man, the man may, the man my mother helped the police capture was innocent. The police constructed, contained him with the meat. Medium had all been carried out in secret, of course. Maya didn't help at all. Yeah, true. But a man found out about it and leaked it, leaked it, it to the, pre the press. He told all the papers that my mother was a fraud, and they, the major media, jumped on it big time. She, she's my mother, became a laughing stock of the nation. I see. White. Excuse me, White? That was his name. My sister told me. White. Hmm. Just a little longer now. Before the stage appointment. Before the state appointment. Lawyers are coming, I guess. 4 p.m. Time's up. What should I do? Do I, ju do I just leave her here and go home? I'll defend Maya. Made up my mind. I'm going to defend you. Where, wherever you want me to do or not. Why? What? Why? Well, I can't ban you. Someone else is. I don't know why. I can't just. I can't abandon you. You've already. I've already like you know. You. We've already been through too much. It's no. There's no going back. No one is sad as a personal fr without a friend. I know I've been there a long time ago. Why don't I become a lawyer in the first place? Because someone has to look out for the people who have no one there on their side. Present the call. Call the uh, present the phone call. All oh, right. I won't abandon you. You can't. can't you can count on me. That's so kind of you. If. Well, I can't send the phone now. To, uh, well, let's fight this one and get get you out of here. Right. Thank you. Phew, she she smiled at least. She looks like she eternal. One last question. You could you you are innocent, right? Yes. And tr and I trust you. So trust me too. Okay. Okay. It's a deal. So what's next? Something that has been bugging me. Just what was inside that strange woman's drawer? It was. It went. It was when I tried to look into the drawer that she got all defensive. There is. There has to be something in there. Guessing that's it. Um. Backspace. Let's just present the evidence. I'm cool. Okay. Here we are. Maya, what's up? Have you called? You haven't called in a while. Well, I'm actually there. Something I want to hold on to. Uh, it's a clock made of. Yeah, we've already heard this before. Okay, cool. Well, I guess I'm already. Guessing we already know this, so I guess we're moving on. That's the thing, I already presented the phone, you can see. Present. Hey, I've got your phone, cell phone back. Oh, say. I can't. Can I listen to my sister's voice? 
Why is eyes closed? He listened to every word. It's such intense. Go to the hotel, I guess. Yeah, that's what we're gonna probably do next. Four long tears begin rolling down. Again. Thank you. Okay, I guess that's it. <laughs> Let's move to that apartment. See if um. Still an afternoon, sir. Excuse me. You are. Ah. I beg you. I beg your pardon, sir. I am bellboy of the. Inspirement? Ah, oh, whatever. You're, you're the, um, you're that guy who goes door to door to places. What's his name? Ah, uh, room service. You're room service guy now. That's at your service. Well, room service. All oh, right. I came up to deliver room service. Uh, do you know where Miss May might have been? Ah, uh, I believe our guest, Miss May, is currently using the, uh, facilities. If you have need to anything, I will be take we taking my leave please stay as long as you like enjoy ah yeah wait no hey why does he seem like every time i came here i ended up embarrassing myself wait now my ch chance to snoop in that room around ah i almost forgot yeah how did you come back so quick i might have asked may i ask to inform Miss May that you're there in the message you prefer. Please tell her that Mr. Wright, Mr. White of Blue Corp phone. Oh, right. Sure. Mr. White of Blue Corp? Where have I ever heard that name? White. Ah, yes, that's right. She said White, didn't she? That was his name. My sister told me. Ah, we know now. It's the same guy. Why? That means the name was the guy who ruined Maya and ruined Maya and Maya's mother. It couldn't, it couldn't be a coincidence. We're gonna open the damn drawer. There's a screwdriver stuck in, the, in a halfway open drawer. Now my chance to see it look inside. What do I? What do we have here? A wiretap? Hmm. Maybe he's the killer, just saying. Yeah, yeah, just saying, yeah. True, good point, good point. What would a woman like her do, be doing with a thing like this? Why tap is added to you? There is definitely something suspicious about this. Why would she have something like this in her hotel room? There's a story behind all of this. I know it. Alright. I've been using this... I've been using this bit of evidence tomorrow's trial. For Mayor's sake. Trial, yay. I'll get to the I'll get to this woman. I'll get to the woman's bottom. I'll get to this woman's bottom. Wait, I mean you know what I mean. <laughs> oh Bellboy, still there? Uh uh oh. It's time to scram. I'm looking forward to tense going with your with you tomorrow, Miss May. In court. Dun 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 Yes. How long did that go for? What? Man, that went for an hour, Jesus. Dun 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 September 7, 10 a.m. Direct cor cor corner, custom courtroom number one. Court is now in session for the trial of Miss May Fry. Prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Edworth. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Miles Edgeworth. I better not show any signs of weakness. Or he'll be on me in an instant. Mr. Edgeworth, please give, please give the court your opening statement. Thank you, Your Honor. The defense, Miss May, was at the scene of the crime. The profession has evidence that she committed the this murder, and we have the witness who saw her do it. Prosecution sees no reason to doubt. 
the fact case. I see. Thank you, Mr. Edgeworth. Let's begin. It may call your... May, uh, we may call our first witness, Your Honor. Prosecution calls for the chief of officer, chief officer at the scene, Detective Gumshoe. Oh god, here we go. Witness, please state your name and pres profession to the court. No, no, not the fur not the fairy. No, no, we're doing Gumshoe, <laughs> sir. Okay, good. My name is Dick Gumshoe, sir. I am the detective in the charge of the homicide. Down at the precinct. Detective Gumshoe, please describe for us the details of the murder. Very well, sir. Let us use the f this format of the office to explain. The body, uh, the body was found by the window here. In a cause of death? Loss of blood due to being struck by a blunt object, sir. The murder weapon is that of the finger, the statue of the finger, found next to the body. Sir. It was heavy enough to be a deadly weapon, even a girl in a girl's hand, sir. The court accepts this statue as evidence. Are you still calling, this, calling it a statue? The floor plan has added added to the, the court record. Now, detective. Yes, sir. You're in, you're an inmate, uh, in the criminal inmate he arrested Miss Fry, uh, Miss May Fry, who was found at the scene, at the scene, correct? Those Thursdays, the test testimony? Ah, yes. Thursdays, the testimony. Yes. X, the scene, correct? Can you tell me why? Yes, sir. I had, I heard the evidence. I uh, had the evidence. She did it. She did it, sir. Hmm. Detective Gumshoe, please testify to court about this hard evidence. Witness testimony. Here we go. As soon as the phone call came, in the rush of the scene, I rushed to the scene. There was two people in there. Already. Defendant Miss May Fry and the lawyer Mr. Phoenix Wright. The inmate arrested. I immediately arrested Miss Fry. Why why we had to a witness accounted descripting her describing her. The witness saw Miss May Fry at the very moment of the murder. Okay. That's very it's the moment, that's very movement, very moment, say. And who was, who was that witness? It was the pink girl. Hey, one of my favorite games. Yeah, we're playing your favorite game, man. Um, hmm, this very moment, you say? Very well, Mr. Wright. Could you begin your cross-examination? Yes, Your Honor. Cross-examination, what? I couldn't see, I couldn't see, see any, a sign of comfort. Of this testimony. Whoosh. Smack. Hey, Myers just threw, threw something at me. This, what's this? When my sister couldn't find any convention in the witness testimony, he wouldn't bluff it and press the witness on every detail. The one when he said the witness saw it. Yeah, I don't think he's. I don't think she will see anything though. That's the problem. She was too high up. She may have saw someone in there, but I don't think she ever saw someone attack someone. He wouldn't bluff and bluff it and present the witness on every detail. The witness always slipped up and say something wrong. It worked a lot of times. Hmm. I shouldn't have expected Maya would. Wouldn't know something of her tricks. All right, let's give this a try. Something the matter? No, Your Honor. I'll be. I like to begin my cross examination. The one, the one when he said 
when said he uh, the one he said the witness saw it cross cross examinate yeah all right ah, mayor fries a rep as soon as the phone call came in a rush of the I rushed to the scene. That is true. He did rush to the scene. There was a lot of police came and the police did come. There was two people already. Already. The judge is always the same thing. Yeah. There were two people there already. Defendant Miss Fry and the lawyer Miss Phoenix Ryan. Okay. I am in, in, immediately arrested Miss A. Fry. That is true. Why we had a witness across the building. Wait, what did you say? The one where he says the witness saw it. Why we had a witness account the disturbance. Yeah, that's uh, that's a lie. Um, she saw, she, she wasn't disturb, disturbing any hurt, wasn't disturbing her. Stop saying it may, as may fry. I know you have dyslexia, but fry is the way uncomfortable to me. Oh, shut up, Carl. It's not that bad. Calm down. The witness knew a person, person thing. Yeah. Hello. Hey, DMK. I see you. How do I... Hang on. Why we had a witness account called the disturbing term. Uh, the witness no knew the person person knew Phoenix. Oh, the mass autopsy. Oh, right, yes. It was the it was the jury. Oh, what's Miss Free? There you go. He's happy now. It's free. Huh? One of the disturbance. Okay. Oh goddamn! I keep doing that. The time of death is nine p.m. Calls a single. Uh. This evidence clearly reveals that Your Honor. Not exactly that I that evidence uh, statement just for now realize. They ain't they. They aren't. Are they? Not at all. Mr. Wright, please think facts over before you Damn it. I don't think that won me point in of course. The witness saw Miss May cry at the very moment of the murder. That is impossible. Dude, I meant like the last statement. I'm sorry. I, I thought that was the last statement. Sorry. Objection! Your Honor, that statement contains the evidence. Hmm? It does? I don't see anything. Cons Terry. Uh, really? Objection overruled. I had to think before making a pick. What? You said the last one. Whoops. Didn't go so well. That's the thing. There's none. I couldn't see a single constitute in there. What? Yeah. Carl. I have to take my advice and press him anything suspicious. As soon as the phone call came in the... I rushed to the scene. Okay. There was two people already. The defense, Miss Fry... Miss Frey... Free. And the lawyer, Miss Phoenix Bryant. I, I immediately arrested Miss Frey. Hmm. Well, I think they changed it. Well, yeah, I'm guessing they did. This is hard. Um, there was already two people there. 
How far into the case are you? Oh, well, we just started the case, so... What if I press Q? Hold it. Oh, it's... Are you absolutely sure it was us? Listen, pal, you have done... Oh, it's... Oh, you two stand out like suspicious people at a crime scene. Well, I had a, had a point had a point there. You're pretty unsuspectable. I shouldn't pick them. Case. Oh, I see, I see, I see, I see. Hang on, I got it. I'll come back tomorrow. I don't like this game. That's okay, DMK. That's okay, man. I get it. You gotta press him for information. Why we had a witness according to this disturbance here. Witness saw may, may, this mayor cry free at the very moment of the murder. Maybe you have to do this. Hold it! Hold it one just second. Yes. If you heard if I heard this correctly, you said the arrest you arrested her because you had had hard evidence. You did it, correct? Um, huh. Did, did I say that? Me? I heard you say it. You did say it. You did say it. Exactly what, what about the suspicious woman in pink, pink calmed with her hard evidence? What? This May, this May isn't suspicious and she sure, sure isn't pink, pal. Well, I guess she's, she is pink. That's enough, Detective Gumshoe. Do you have any more solid proof other than a claim, claim detective? No, I'm lagging. Every 1.0, 0 0.1 seconds. Hold it. Her claims detective? Um, hmm. Yes, the pressing can have its advantage. Yes. <sighs> Sorry, I got the order of the things mixed up in my my testimony right now. There's was something I shouldn't have told you about first. Told you about first, Your Honor. Very well, Detective. Let's let's hear your testimony again. Hard evidence. Okay. After scaring suspicious um after scaring the suspicious experiment scene the scene of my crime with my own eyes. Okay. I found an memento written on the piece of paper next to the body, next to the victim's body. Hold it. On it, the the word Maya was written clearly in the in blood. The lab test results showed that the blood was the victim. Also, we were. Also, there there was blood found on the victim's fingers. Before she died, the victim wrote the killer's name. How's that possible? How would you like that? That's my hard evidence. Hmm. Before you be begin your cross-examination, I have a question for you, detective. Okay, now I'm sure. Your Honor? Why didn't you testify about this viral piece of evidence the first time? Had hard evidence before. Present Maya's autopsy reporting the sixth statement. Yeah. Why didn't you testify about the victim by this piece of uh, evidence first time? Uh, uh, I know. I really, am, I'm really bad. I forgot about it, Your Honor. Try more. Try to be more careful. Very well. The defense may begin the cross examination. Don't give him it. Don't give it him. Don't give. Him. Don't give it him. What? Am I correct? Cross examination. You haven't seen this game before. After searching the suspicious exa example, he exa examined the scene. Of my crime with my own eyes. I found a memento written on the piece of paper next to the victim's body. You're guessing. Okay, 
It's fine. Okay, it's fine. If it was get guessing. Um, Grim was Meyer. Was clearly ridden with in blood. Why am I burping so much? Blood's test results showed that the blood was the victim's. Present the report in the sixth thing. Okay. Also, the blood was found on the victim. Hang on a second. I can't remember what we were on. Hang on. Sorry, right, I have to go back. Okay, one, two, I run two, three, four, five, six. Before she died, the victim wrote her the name. Wait, wait, but don't do it yet. Okay, what do you want me to do? You want me to just press him, see what happens? I get it, what Carl, Carl's mean. I, I get what Carl means. Okay, okay, now do it. It's do or die. Why? I don't know. I'm not sure. Don't, doesn't the autopsy say was the killer instead? Cause of death was single upon travel. That was explosive. Yes. Carl, have 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 you seen this game before? Yes. How could how could she have written it in blood if she was she was killed in, instantaneously? The death was instantaneous. Yeah, that's right. She couldn't have written it before she died. How could she? That was impossible. There was no way she could do it that quickly. She can't do it before she died. She died instantaneously. It says here. Mm hmm. Present. Carl, you're not meant to say it. Objection! Take the gum chew. There's one thing I want to clarify for me here. He said the victim, May Fryer, wrote this note. That, that was a coincidence. The defense, May Free. That really what you were saying? Really what you're saying? What, uh, what, this is one of these lawyer tricks now, isn't it? Of course she wrote it. Who else could have? have? Because is he's a big brain? Uh, your big brain? You haven't, haven't back, you, uh, you have it backwards, detective. Backwards? The victim is only presented who absolutely could not have written it. The report from the department detective, uh, apartment detective, immediately death due to blow from the object. She died immediately. But, no hey, buts, I'm not, but I'm not butting your way out of this one. There is two scenes of their place stations in their sh The only shower they originally seen is the choice of scenes. Okay. I've been watching this anime and I don't know how it discount sounds really stupid. Order, order. The fence has a point. Somehow who died it who someone who dies immediately wouldn't have the time to write anything down. Objection! Mr. Wright, I beg you to I beg your pardon, but ha when exactly did you know obtaining the autopsy room? Well, when, when the day of the murder, the day after the murder, I forgot. The day after the murder, we got it the day after, right? Because we didn't get it the day of the murder, it was the day after, because it was yesterday. Oh yes, the, the updated autopsy, autopsy room. We got, we, the day after the murder. It would be not before the murder, like, because she wasn't dead before. She was alive. So we got it the day after the murder. Detective, Detective Gumshoe gave us, gave us it. I forget. No, I'm not doing, I forget it, because that's stupid. Because we got the day, remember, we got the, we got the autopsy before, before, we got the autopsy report 
because the detective gave it to us. We got it the day after the murder. It wasn't the day of the murder. There was no way the day of the murder can get the thing in there. It must be in the day after. Yes, it's the day after the murder. It was the day, the day after the murder. That's, that's a progressive point. That's progression, progression points. The other top support is out of date, Your Honor. What? The second autopsy was performed yesterday at Myra's request. Death was almost instantaneous due to the blunt, due to the blow from the blunt object. Yep, it's out of date. The autopsy report. Yeah, I just. But there is a possibility the victim lived several more minutes after the blow. I received the results this morning. That's the reason we got it the day after. No way. Your Honor, it's quite easy to imagine that the victim had did victim did have time to write Maya. That's all that is all. I see. Damn you, Edgeworth. I shouldn't have known you had something up up your sleeve. Forgotten evidence? Now I now I get the joke last, last stream. Forgotten evidence? Yeah. Forgotten evidence. Yeah, you get it? Why, Mr. Wright, you're looking shocked. Something you want to say? You're shame. You are ashamed, Edworth. The detective's a slum. I am a slum. Sham. Sham. I'm a sham. Next is a sham. You're a sham, Edworth. It's painful to write something in blood. Yeah. I'm ashamed. I'm ashamed. Detective Gumshoe. I was a fool to trust you in your report. Ah, me? I was I wasn't uh Detective Gumshoe. Hm. I'm disappointed in you. Handling him handling him with the wrong report like that. Ah, I I'm sorry, sir. Wait, that worked? You are you are the fault, detective. This isn't going to look good on your evidence next month. Wait, what? But your honor, the submit had this report to your count court. Understood. The, the correct evidence. Dive from the blow. Um, dive from the blow by burnt, blunt object. May have lived from several for minutes. Few minutes after being dead, I was detective a shame. Ah, uh, cool. Was the detective a sl slam? Shame? Yeah, not really. Edgeworth is more a sh sham. Frick. Well, your honor, the evidence strongly suggests the victim was definitely the killer. I suppose that's correct. Yes. Done. This ain't good. Good. The prosecution would like to call the next question. Yes. The poor in innocent girl saw the murder with her own eyes. It's impossible. She hadn't seen anything with her own eyes. She was up in the building. One thing she probably saw was the person walk into the room. I don't remember what's next now. Okay, here we go. Let's the witness Miss Miss April. May you take the stand? Exactly. With the part of her in incoming. Exactly, the part of her is coming. Here we go. I'm going to think to tell what I think about pink hair. Now, of course, you already told us. Witness your name, and please. Witness your name, please. April May. At your service. Wink. Order in the court. In order. The inquestor should not request any request from the crowd. The witness finds from Watson Walk Winking. Ah, you're yes, Your Honor. This is not good. You really captured the heart of every every man in this courtroom. Tell us where were you on the night of December fifth when the murder occurred? Ah, uh, geez, I was I was like in my hotel room. Do you hear? I. Oh, 
God's sake. Uh, I checked, I checked it right after lunch. And this is the hotel during across from the Fry and Co lawyer office. Um, that's right. Big boy. Please testify in the court about what you saw. Why? This ain't lunch. <laughs> this isn't, this isn't after lunch, Carl. It's not, it's not why. It was like nine at night. I looked out the window. That's impossible. And then I, then oh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. The one attacking her was a mousy girl sitting in the defendant's chair. Then the woman like dodged, dodged the one side of and ran the other way. 9 p.m. at lunch. But the but that girl, she caught up to her and she hit her. That's there was the woman with her long hair. Then the woman with the long hair, she kind of slumped. In the end. That's all I saw. Every time, every oh, and she saw the murder. She checked the lunch. She checked. It in the lunch and stayed in the ho in her hotel room and then she saw the murder. Oh, but Carl's got called a simp. Oh, I think pressing one when she said notifying defendants. Time busy winking. Hmm. I don't know. Simp. Just kidding. Well, Your Honor, I see, it's remarkable solid testimony. I don't see the need to trouble the witness any Wait, Your Honor. Yes, Mr. Wright? What about the cross-examination? Oh, I thought, thought the witness testimony just now was quite fir firm, didn't you? Mr. Wright, I understand you're, you're Miss Fry's underage Where, why, where, you not? You must know her technically well. Her, her crowd very f finding tiny faults her good testimony. Hey, how dare you? Well, Mr. Wright, we'll cross-examinate the witness. Well, Mr. Wright, will you cross-examinate the witness? Yes, I am doing it. No? Oh. Yes? No? Oh god, here we go again. <laughs> she'll shield the call. We sh sh she'll, she'll call her an e girl because she is. Oh, for god's sake. Yes, yes, no. <sighs> uh, well, we got to cross examine her. We have to. There's no way. Yes, I'm doing it. No thanks. Oh, god damn it. Because she is. Okay, well, we gotta do it. There's no other way. I can't think of anything else we can do. Yes, I'm doing it. I'm glad you pressed it, cross examination with it. If only because I have feelings Edgeworth doesn't want me to. She has to have some weakness. Very well, you may begin your cross examination. No, I meant no, because she made people sims. Ah. It was like 9 p.m. at night. I looked out the window. No. And then, oh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. The one attacking her with the with mousy girl sitting in the defendant's chair. Then I, then the woman, then the woman, like, dodged to one side of her and ran away. Well, Matt, already had trouble with a yes or no question. The third. True. Hey, listen, I, I was thinking about it and I was like, one, two. I think it's the third one. Well, with, look, 
Then the woman dodged to one side and ran away. That's why she's an e-girl. <laughs> but the girl, she caught up to her and she hit her. Hmm. That's it. Oh, jeez. I'm really jumping out. There's got to be something in this somewhere. Maybe I can get better if you press her on her facts a bit. True. True. Look at the her posture. Pose. True. Hmm. And then, oh, I saw a woman with long hair being attacked. Okay. Why does it have a presser on one thing? April is now the ego. I think if... I think sentiment... Then one... Hold it. How do you know she was the defendant? Ah, well, you know. She said she's girl's fist fit wouldn't wouldn't know the same thing. Look, I just know, okay? These are only one person at the scene of the crime with a short goldfish girlfish figure. Aha, you got the bitch. <laughs> the testimony is bulletproof. Oh. He's right. Yep, he's right. I have to question the testimony. I knew it. I have to question the testimony. There's no other way. Yep, he's right. No, I can't say he's right. It makes no sense. Right? This must be more. We have to keep going. Only Maya were, were, were that outfit. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Nope, you are not. No, you're not going to be a. I I question question the testimony. Come on, there must be a way. We must be missing something. The only way I can think of that is where we go question something. Ah, uh, Jesus, we got question. Hold it, hold a minute. That's an that's my sink. Miss May, I'm willing to bet that you saw nothing. You're lying. Matt, that's the only yes or no question. I know, I know, shut up. You saw nothing. At 9 o'clock at night, you wouldn't see a thing. The office was dark. You're lying. That makes sense. Like, that's the thing. At 9 o'clock at night, you wouldn't see a thing. Lying? Yeah. He's, she's lying. I think. You really boast my confidence. Yeah, lying. The light. Broken. Yeah, the light's broken. You couldn't see a thing. I agree. Remember? Yeah, the light was broken. Yeah, you're right. The light was broken. You couldn't see a thing in that office. The only thing you'll probably see is a barely bit of light, but nothing thing. You saw nothing. There was nothing there. You called it before. Remember? You called the police. We saw you call the police. Yeah. You saw nothing. Lying? Yeah, you're a good point. Couldn't be lying, right? No, nothing. No, yeah, you, she saw nothing. The lights were broken. Did you really see a defendant at the defendant at all? Uh, uh actually, it could be better. That's the right. What's the meaning of this? Yes, this is meaning some. Telling me because I am clueless and about meaning. Okay. If you had really witnessed Mr. Klein, Mr. Klein's Mary Free, she could be lying. Saw no something. She couldn't be seeing anything. The lamp was broken. You wouldn't have noticed her clothes before no noticing her phys physicality. Uh oh. Mary Free? Oh, Mary Free. God damn it. Sh shut up. No one was wearing clothes like this on the day, daily basics, except her. I'm not expecting the fashion, but her hydro looks far from normal to me. 
Because there's only one that was wearing that, yeah. However, the witness testimony mentions neither of these things. Testimony is bogus. Freaking knew it, Dan. The testimony is bogus. But, but, still, what? We don't know if she was aggressive. Maybe the night of the murder. She was, Your Honor. I saw her. And she did. And, and so did Detective Gumshoe. What do you say to that, Miss May? Bruh. Ra, what are you trying to say? You mean, you mean lawyer? I saw, I saw, I was, I saw what I saw. I just didn't think of all the terrifying little details was necessary during this May. The court would like to remind you, please omit nothing to the testimony. I'm sorry, Your Honor. I've, I'll be a good girl. I promise, wink. Stop winking in court. It's not funny, right? I get it. You're hot, but no one cares. <laughs> Just don't winking in court, Bruh, He's doing his job. Let's just marry again, if you would. Damn. I almost had her. I need to get her one more thing. I didn't. I did see. I I did see everything. I did. The victim. The woman dodged the first attack and ran off to the right. Okay, that's... Honestly, April looks like... Alien, but yeah. Ran off to the right. Everything? Yeah, then the girl in the... In the girl, the hippie clothes ran after her. And she hit her that's, with that weapon. I saw it. I saw it did. The clock. Um the kind of statue clock. The thinker, I think. How did you know it was the thinker? Well, does that accused from reports not sailing of you, Teehee? That's impossible. How'd she knew it was a clock? No one told her it was a clock. That's the thing. How did she know it was a clock? She had no idea. She was up in a hotel room. Right, it was a clock. How did she know? How did she know it was a clock? Yeah, exactly. How did she know? She had no idea. She only saw it was a statue. I only wish you had seen details from the beginning. Please begin your cross-examination. That's impossible. How the hell did she know it was a clock? No one mentioned to her it was a clock. I did see everything. I did. The victim, the woman, dodged the first attack and... Right. Then the girl that happens to cross ran after her. And she hit her with that weapon. I saw it. I did. I gotta go. Okay, Miss Okay, Nugget. Present the thinker? Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. That clock, um, that kind of statue. How did you know it was a clock? The thinker. The murder weapon looks like a statue, but actually it was a clock. Maybe made by Lay Lay's buzz. Present the thinker? See ya? Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. Because how the hell she knew it was a clock? There's no way she knew. She only knew it was a statue. How did she knew it was a clock? Objection! It's May. What you said n just now was quite revealing. Revealing? Oh, you'll like that, wouldn't you, naughty Mr. William? You just said this state of the thinker was a clock. But there was no way you knew knowing that you just by looking at it. Uh an authority person much is much the same qu persuasion as your reality called as a clock too. Called this a clock too. And he found he found it and he was found guilty of murder. Um, order, order. Miss May, can you explain how you knew this was a clock? Oh, uh... Objection! Oh, goddammit. The witness saw the murder with her own eyes. That's 
all the information here. The defense is trying to confuse the issue with travel concerns. Yes, yes, of course. You will withdraw your question, Mr. Wright? Objection! But questioning all I have. But questioning are you all I have, Your Honor. As you know, as you may recall, the court murder murderer with the question before. Well, only once. Objection is saying You may continue with your questioning. Questioning the witness. Phew, that was close. If you had stopped me there, the trial would be over. Uh, what? So, what happens now? What happens now if you answer the question? A question. How do you know it was a clock? What? The, that's... Because I heard it. How did you hear it? You were up in a hotel room. Yes, I heard it. It was... At... Yes, I heard it. It says, it says the time. So, you've been to the lawyer's office of Faye Co. No. Hey, I didn't say that. Why would you... Why would I go there? I heard it from the hotel room. Hee <laughs> hee. That's impossible. How the hell can you hear it from there? The window was closed. The lawyer's office of Fair Co. where the murder took place. It's very close to the hotel. She couldn't. She couldn't easily heard, heard, have heard the clock. We know the statues. Hello. It's there's no. It's impossible. Maybe she used to, the wiretap to the cell phone. Heard the conversation through the phone the clock. That is true, but we all know from the phone call it was hollow. Remember, she holded it out. Remember? It was hollow. She put papers in there. So if that's the case, what would we know? Hmm. Well, Mr. Wright, are you satisfied? Hell no. No, Your Honor. I can't, I can't give up now. I'm not satisfied because... Oh, I was about to press enter there, I was about to... She couldn't have heard it. She could have... I couldn't have ra rang? 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 I couldn't have rang. She couldn't have heard it. That's true, right? There's no way she could have heard it from a hotel room. Only the wiretap can probably... That's probably how she did it. That's how she knows it's a clock. She must have heard it through the wiretap. She couldn't have heard it. You were you're in the ho you were at a hotel. There's no way you could have heard the clock go off in the next building. Objection! You have proof of that? She couldn't not. Um. Abstain. Objection. I'm saying, Mister. Listen to me, Mister Wright. In this courtroom, proof is everything. Without it, you have nothing. Are you nothing? Then what would what would like to present the test to see if she really could have her? The presentation dance your request. What? On what grounds? It's trivial matters, with no direct burning of of her hand. Ow! She couldn't have heard it. She was in the next hotel room. Um, being case in the, at hand. Indeed, objection is stained. Dang, time to switch up distraction. Quick. Ready with the prosecution, Mr. Wright? No, Your Honor. Can't give up now. I'm not satisfied because I couldn't have rang. Your Honor, members of the court. It's incredible that that clock was the incredible the incredible of the clock is in question. It's empty. It's broken. The batteries are dead. It's empty. Remember, remember in the phone call the day before the murder, it was empty. There was no way the clock could sound off. It's empty. Yeah, because remember in the phone call she said it's empty. I put papers in there. Remember, there's no clock in there. She's held it out. There's no way she can do it. Yes, she removed the clock words. The clock works. Yeah, it's empty. The clock is missing. 
The clock works. How could this be possible? Just take a look, right now. Oh! See anything including your honor? Is the... Is this as defense day? The clock is missing, the clock works. It's qu it's quite empty. Just a right. How would you how can how can explain to court the meaning of this? It is it is as you can see. The clock was empty. I could it couldn't have rang. Therefore, this witness is a big fat liar. <laughs> fat. Well, Miss May. Oh God damn it! Tisk tisk. Oh what now, Edgeworth? Hmm? Quite a show you've put on for us, Miss Wright. He know he knew the clock was empty. Somehow he knew. I'm afraid you've forgotten one thing, however. Indeed, the clock was empty. The clock is empty, as you say. It can't ring. However, you we must ask when was the clock work removed? It was after the witness had heard the clock, then there there was no content. No, it was before that he's lying. Hmm, that's true. That that is possible. The clock might have been empty after the he heard it. That's impossible, because we have the cell phone to prove it. And that's is example of what happens. Well, Mr. Wright, can you prove when the clock wood was removed? Oh ho, impossible, of course. Actually, no it's not, we have, I have proof. Wait, what? Wasn't it you who told me proof is everything? Well, I was listening. And now I'll show you the proof. You, sh you would like so much. Then the evidence proves when the clock was removed. Because we have the phone call that proves that it was empty. The phone is the one, the phone kernel, I think. Yes. Hey, Matt, even Death Notes. <laughs> hey, Matt, even watch the Death Note? Yeah, I saw the Death Note. Well, that's the thing, right? That's the thing right now. Because we all know it was in the past, lol. Yeah, of course. It was in, it was the phone. Like, see, watch. Um, it shouldn't probably tell you the clock wasn't taking, taking right now. Uh, what, what, it's not working? Lame. No, I had the, take them the clock out. Sorry, I put in some parts and said, yeah, see. We knew it was empty because we had the phone call to prove it. Take that! Take a look at this. Um, is that a very cute cell phone? Is that a very cute phone? Oh, huh. I have, you have a girly, girlish phone. Wait. But this is, isn't my phone. Listen, this is the, the defense cell phone and encounters a recording. A recording of the conversation she had with the victim on the day of the murder. Order, order. The defense cell phone, that's, this wasn't both to my attention. Perhaps the detective Gumshoe overlooked it. Gumshoe, Gumbrella. I could good for Detective Bennett remembered he's up for the vaccination soon. I gotta say, I'm starting to see to feel bad for the big fella. Let's let's hear the conversation. So you want me to hold on to the thinker for you then? If you could. Ah, I should probably tell you the clock wasn't isn't taking ticking right now. Huh? Is it not working? That's lame. I had to take out the clock words out, sorry. Your Honor? I think the, that makes the clear that makes it clean the clock words are already gone by the time it was recorded. Which that was which was all before the witness even arrived to her hotel. Hmm. Uh ha <laughs> Well, Miss May, would you care to explain this to the court? Just how did you know the weapon was a clock? Well, 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 it isn't obviously. 
I saw that clock before. Uh, what store was that again? I'll, I'll go to so many. Oops, I forgot. Wink. Actually, it was not made. She couldn't bought it at the store. Remember? There was no way she could bought it in the store because it's handmade by Buzz. So the witness has seen it before. That would make sense. Store? There's no way he. The guy. Does that defense any objection, Mr. Wright? Does the defense have any objections? Right. Yes, I object. Objection. Larry Buzz is the only one who made the two. Yeah, of course. Does the defense have any objections, Mr. Wright? Yes, of course I do. You got hair red handed. DG, no re. The witness claims to have ha had seen it before, but that's directly a piece of evidence already submitted to the court. Well then, let's see it. Please pronounce the evidence that will prove the witness had not seen this clock before. Because it's made by Buzz. Buzz knows he made it. Because it says it made by Larry Buzz. There's no other way no one can make it at. He, she did not see that at store. Because it was made by Buzz. The statue is our key to get out of here. Take that! It's simple. The clock was never in any store ever. What? A friend of mine made the clock. A clock. Only two exist in the world. And the only... And, it, and the one that isn't here in the police custody. Impossible. Everything is sold in stores. Miss May, I think you, the high time you want to sh went shopping for a better excuse. Damn, damn, what a roast! Goddamn, got him. <laughs> that was that was so good. That was got him. Got her. Damn, damn. Play ointment to burn everybody. Jesus. Oh, excuse me. Not on a sale today. Oh, ha ha ha. Hmm. Oh, goddamn. Ah, ah. Oh, she's mad. What is it to you? Pronounce pro this head? That stupid clock doesn't matter, okay? She did it, and she shouldn't die. She should have died for it. Die. Uh oh, she's uh. Damn. Whoa, let's not get ahead of ourselves. This is a court of law, and the witness will remain. remain calm. Uh. Huh. Oh. Oh. Uh ha ha. Uh ha. Uh, Silly me. Grr. Grunt. Did I, um, like, lose it? I guess I did, Teehee. Scary. It's May. Let us ask. Let me ask. Tell me, how did you know the weapon was a clock? <laughs> hmm. Oh dear. Does the defense have any option objections on this behalf? Dude, she scared me now. Yeah. Okay, this is this is it. Yes, Your Honor. Allow me to explain how I see the truth of the matter. Miss April May, you knew the weapon was a clock because you heard it. You had you heard it about you heard about it. There's no way she heard it. Held it. Right. You held. There's no way she held it. She was in the other room. You heard heard about it. Remember, it was remember it was in the newspaper when she heard about that. Remember, the court was yesterday. She heard about it. She didn't held it. She heard about it. She heard about it on the cell phone. Not that too. And also, remember, that's true. Yeah, remember, she, remember this court was happening yesterday. She heard about it. The witness heard of, never held the clock in her hand. The witness never held the clock in her hand. However, she heard it. She heard that it was a clock. She heard? That's correct. I don't know. There is no other way she put, couldn't have known that the, tink, the finger was a clock. And she can show, show you the proof. Well, this is in interesting. Let us see then. Show the evidence proving that the witness had heard the murder weapon was a clock. Uh, 
Uh, the wiretap? He found this in this room, yeah. And heard the murder weapon was a clock. He found this in... Ah, oh, man, I thought I had a good case. Ah, oh, Jesus. I think it's a wiretap, too. Yeah, I believe it's a wiretap, right? Because that's the only way I can think about it. thing. So, I think it's a wiretap. Let's try it. Take that! Have a look at this. Ah, oh, that, that, uh. I found this in Miss May's room. Order in the court. Order, order. Yes, right. Please explain to the court. What is that? It's April May. You were tapping the victim's Miss May's phone, were you not? Oh, oh. Objection! Oh God, here we go. Your Honor, this is inre is irrelevant. I'm not. I'm not in internal sure that is it. Objection revealed. Re re I'm, I'm terribly. I'm troubled me that our witness was in professional of a wire procession of a wiretap. This is outrageous. Does this defense truly claim that the firm was was uh, the firm witness was tapped the phone? Yes, because the. Absolutely, because remember the phone was, remember that some of the screws on the back of the phone was untapped. So you guys remember when we looked at the phone, where the phone had a few screws loose? That's when the wiretap was. Even if that was the case, which, which is not still have to prove in one, one anything. Did the victim ever say that the weapon was a clock on the phone? Well, no. That's why. Did the victim ever say the weapon was a, f a clock on the phone? Yes, yeah, she did. She said it was a clock, but she did. Can you prove that? I think not. Oh yeah, I think I can. It's simple. What? Here's my proof. Proof that the victim said no. The phone was that. The weapon was a clock. Proof that the victim said the on the phone that the weapon was a, was a clock. <laughs> ah, shit. <laughs> um, on it, f the phone, the statue, the clock, the the clock's gear has been removed. Cell phone, yeah, the cell phone, right? Super Edgeworth, the cell phone. Yes, you're right. Sorry, I was about to say the statue, but yes, the cell phone did say it was a clock. That's my bad, sorry. Take that! The defense, defense presents the cell phone? Yes, we have seen that. Listen to one more time between the defendant and the victim. Maya, what's, what's up? Have you, you haven't called in a while. Well, actually, something I want you to ha hold on for me. Again, what is it? What's it this time? It's a, it's a clock. It's made look like the statue, the Finko, and it tells you it tells you the time. It's April May. You used a wiretap to listen to the conversation. That's how you knew that Finko was a clock. Am I wrong? I I. Objection! Your Honor, this is in this is ridiculous. Your Honor, look at the witness face. Does she seem a suit? Shamed to you? The defense demands answers. La, la, uh. Witness, answer the question. Did you tap her phone? Miss May. Shut up, all of you. All of you. What gives you. Oh, you're. You're. You, you, lawyer. Oh no. Uh, it's not fair. All. Oh, I'm going to gang up on me like that. Oh, so I'm bad girl. Is that it? Is that all? Uh, uh, ah, why is she crying? That did it. The correct the count seems that real Miss April may now. Now to deal the final blow. Why the wiretap? You did it, didn't you? No, she didn't do it. 
Why the why I tap? She that makes sense. She didn't do it. She saw it, but she didn't do it. Right? Why the why I tap? That's why I want to know. Right? Why the why I tap? Because that makes the most sense. Think about it. Why did she have a wire tap in that phone? She didn't. She did do it. Did you think she did it? No. I, she didn't do it. Right? We know she didn't do it. Why the wire tap? Why did she need the wire tap? Why did you, why did you tape, tape her on phone? Why the what? Yeah. Why did you tape her phone? Answer the question. I don't have to. Isn't a murder trial? Isn't taping, 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 or investigation? Gosh, she's saying excuses, but Edgeworth wants her to say. Miss May, you are tapping the victim's phone. I, I hardly call that irrelevant. Irrelevant, irrelevant. While the court does does not contain the defense tones of voice, he has a point. Well, Miss May, do you have any explanation for the Can you prove you had nothing to do with the murder even though you tapped her phone? Ah, like, like, ah, I like to see her pull that, that off. Mr. Lawyer, I saw that evil, evil grin. You were probably thinking I like to see her pull that off, wasn't you? Damn, she's good. Well, you know I'm the first man who fought that. And, of course, I can and I will. I can't be, you can't be serious, no way. Way, I, way, I say way, oh, and assume you, I am serious, Mr. Lewis. Huh. Okay, so... The killer happens around 9 a.m. at night. Why that just when I was getting a room service from the sweet bellboy? Room service? Iced coffee. I delivered I delivered it. It was. Iced coffee. You know? Like normal coffee, but cold. If you don't drink it quick, the ice melts and then you have regular cold coffee. Call the bellboy? That's actually a good point. Ice coffee. Thinking I'm making this up? Ask the bellboy, wink. A go. The witness was not on the scene at the time of the murder. <laughs> what? So, where does that leave us? It may... This may great disappoint to the inf inform you. That the witness appears to have been tapping the victim's cell phone. However, that is a surprising crime with no being on the current case whatsoever. Her testimony stands. She saw the defense may f may free may free may fry. Oh, God damn it! F e y free f e i fry. I'm just gonna say free. Whatever. It's free. Commits the murder. No, they, they are going to let her wa just walk away. There's no way I can win this unless I tie Miss May to some to the murder somehow. Well, does that defense have anything to say? Hmm, well, come on, think of something. Ah, let's call the bellboy as a witness. That's a good point. Defense would like to call the motel, hotel's bus bellboy at, as a witness. There's some, something suspicious here, and I'm going to get to the bottom of this. I'm thinking you're think sinking quite low, sinking quite low enough already. Objection! Objection! I object to calling the bellboy. Why? What? We, why? What's your reason? Because I hold that the wiretap had nothing to do with the killing. However, if you agree on the conditions, we'll consider the calling witness. Just consider contra control. If Miss April May able is not called into questioning after the exam of the bellboy, then you may recognize that Miss April May was not the killer, though she is innocent. The fee they. 
and they thereby you may also accept the feeling of guilty from the misnay tree. This con con content. What? I better find something spectacular in the bellboy's testimony. Otherwise, Miss May will be kind of guilty on the spot. What should I do? Give up? Accept the con- I can't give up. I have to keep going. Accept the conditions. Alright, I have nothing to lose. Especially, well, every- <laughs> Understood. I accept your condition. Hmm. Cool. You feel- You fell right into my trap. Uh-oh. Uh, uh, um, wait. Very well. The, ca the court has called the hotel's best boy to stand. I believe we're ready for the witness testimony. Testify he considers does look like the bellboy. Yeah, that's definitely the bellboy. Yes, sir. I received your summon in the middle of the of work, sir. I'm happy to be at service. That tea set looks rather heavy, so without further ado, the witness may begin the te his testimony. Very good, sir. Here we go. Miss May's room service. I am... I am heading to... I head... I'm the head of bed bellboy at the fine gateway hotel in the business for Grint. I believe to receive the call at after 8 a.m. Eight, oh, sorry, 8 o'clock. Not a.m., what the hell am I saying? After 8 o'clock in the evening from our guest, Miss May. She asked for a nice coffee to be brought to her at 9 o'clock on the dot. Why 9 o'clock on the dot? I brought it to her at the, pro at the request at the time, of course. And believed that and delivered the iced coffee to our guest, Miss May herself. I see. The defense may begin the cross examination. What do you mean, nine on the dot? Like, nine o'clock on the dot. You know when you do, when I do, you know when I end my streams at like 10 30 on the dot? Like 10 30 on that dot? Suspicious. It is suspicious. Why nine o'clock on the dot? Right, I'm ready. I hope. This is it. If I can't prove Miss May was involved with this, the murder. May will be finished. May I will be finished. Why is that exclusive? Ex exclusive? Eh, uh, maybe, true. Why 9 o'clock on the dot? Do you know why? She needed a witness to make sure she got back to her room in time. Remember, she called at 8 o'clock. She has an hour to do... She has an hour to go down, grab the wiretap, saw, saw the murder happen, right? If we look at the... Remember, we can always press, press, press questions, okay? Think about it. If the murder happened at 9 a.m., right? Whatever time it did, when she saw it... She have made so only do press not present. Yeah, no, don't worry. I'm not. I'm not gonna do. That. I'm gonna press it. I believe to receive a call at, after eight a.m. in the evening. In the evening, from our guest Miss May. She asked for iced coffee to brew brought at nine on the dot. Nine. At the dot. Or at her, her at 9 o'clock. 9 o'clock on the dot. So, just check. Yeah, that's what I'm going to check. Hold it! Hold it. 9 o'clock on the dot, you say? Yes. I can confirm that delivery s service time. She was watching the program on TV, the TV and watched, watched the drink after finishing... So 9 o'clock on the dot, at the same time of the murder? That's true, right? I don't know why I thought of a little boy. Okay. Wait. At the exact same time of the murder, the murder started at 9 o'clock at the dot. 9 o'clock. How did she see it? 
in lieu of the iced coffee, so I guess Miss May herself. The, the bellboy wouldn't have any reason to lie. That is true. But I have to find something to use in his testimony. One more time. I'll press him until he spills the bean or to or the, his tea. Why is holding tea? I don't know. Well, I can press him as many times as I want. By pressing the last statement, I just want to see what happens when I press like any statement. 8 a.m. in the evening. I asked for the coffee at 9 o'clock in the doctor. I brought her to the for a request. I'm delivering the iced coffee. Hold it! Hold it up. You said it was Miss April May herself? Absolutely. Uh, absolutely, sir. Absolutely? Yes, sir. As in very, so very absolutely. Sir. It's an in ground of the meaning. How come you're so very certain? Well, when I brought the room service, sir, she, the guest, uh, froze me with, uh, an embarrassment, sir. Embarrassment? Is that French for embarrassed? It is French for kiss, sir. But not French kiss, sir. More of a peck on the cheek. Why would you say... Why, why would she have done that? I believe that she were meant to swear by prime domination, sir. It was moments I shall I never ever forget, sir. Sounds pretty fishy to me. I think our Miss May was up to something. Wanted to wanted the bellboy to. Uh, it's not good. It's no. It's no good. There's nothing there. This is it. This tisk. Finally, you understand. The bellboy absolutely has had no reason to lie. Now, if you have any disclaims, you would end to rather your paramount trust term that uh, head nose cross examination here. Mm -hmm. It was a bit tenderous, tedious. The witness may have may leave the stand. Can't let this happen. Can I? I just protest. Protest. Wait. Please wait. Yes. Does this defense ha have something to add? One last question. Let me ask one last question. Objection! Your Honor, I must object. This chair of just this is a court of justice. He's gonna go on too long enough. Now, now, Mr. Edgeworth. Already, Mr. Wright. I'll give you one more question. That's it. That's all. Right, this game, you never give up. Yeah, I know, right? Okay. This is really it. This is really it. Now, this is my last chance. What do I think? What do I ask about him? Check in. The room service. Bad making. Bad making. Oh, dude. Should I do the... No, the check in, right? Would that make more sense? Because you had to check in. Because he will tell us what time the person got into the room, right? If we do check in, he'll tell us. That's what I'm meaning, right? I can only think of check in or the room service. Bed making makes no sense. Ah, damn it. I gotta do check in. I have no other choice. Tell me about the check in. Check in? Tell me about when you checked in to Miss May. Oh, alright. Very well, sir. My first thought was that she was... was a beautiful, beautiful person. It was just typing a girl, so it was disappointment, really. Disappointment, really. I see. Excuse me, what exactly was disappointment? Well, I am not without charm, sir, but... Even I'll have a little chance with her lover there. 
I love it. Ah, there we go. Hmm? What did he say? What did you, what did you say? Oh, oh, either request. Bellboy, tell us the truth. Tell us the truth now. Did Miss May check in with another person? Objection! No, oh, here we go. Objection. That was objectable. Objectivation. Objection overruled. This witness answered the question. Uh, yes, I see. Why did you not mention this in the testimony? In your testimony? Well, sir, you, uh, you didn't ask. Nice try. That's the sort of thing you normally supposed to mention. Ah, yes, quite. Indeed. It was there, uh, good... Buried there's Mr. Edgeworth, who? Ah! He asked me to not mention it if I wasn't successfully asked, sir. Oof. You fool. Why is he, why is he trying so hard? I've done it. I've won. Miss April May, check into a twin room with a man. Correct. Yes, sir. Then where, where you brought their rooms, when, then when you brought their room service, you didn't see the man in the room. That's right, sir. Hmm. Your Honor, we have just learned of another person involved who may have been the murderer. In the light of the, this new fact, I hold that it is impo impossible to judge the defendant. Wouldn't you agree, Mr. Edgeworth? And who, and who, Mr. Wright, who is this other person? Simple, was the man with April May. The man who checked in with Miss May. Oof. Your Honor, as I have previously received, Miss April May, April May was tipping the victim's f tapping with the victim's phone. Yet Miss May her herself has a build the time of the murder. However, that does not clear the man that was with her. The bellboy saw no one else in the room at the time of the murder. But what convenient will, will set up, but it's too late. Too late? I suppose you like it if you, I was, it was too late, wouldn't you? Some reason I thought it was Edgeworth. Yeah. After all, it was. Uh, after all, it was you who hid the prostitution from the other man of the court. Oof. Ups. Start management. The, they're accusing our inclusives. Enough. The court acknowledged the defense argument. I example the progress and defend who look into this matter fully. I am, I, am I understood? Yes. Yes, Your Honor. That's, that is all today of, for the trial of May, May 3. Feb. Bar. Whatever. Court is adjourned. Same. September 7, 2.24 p.m. Detective Court Defense Lobby Number 1. Mr. Wright, you were amazing in there. Really? I think I might be your newest fan. Oh, I was just doing my job, you know. <laughs> that again, that again, the other attorney was pretty cool though. Who, huh? That face of his, with his eyes wide and trembling lips. It was up my shivers up my spine. Then shivers up my spine. Hmm. If you say so. So what happens with me? Do I get to go home now? Uh. Well. No, I don't think so. Not yet. Oh, I see. But I got to. But I got a great lead in today's trial. Can you put a webcam in the top left scene? Oh, sure.
Second, everyone. Yeah. There, guys, a bit better. You aren't really fit missing much. Can you put the webcam in the top left corner? Screen. Top left of the screen. Is that better? Can you see everything now? See? You see what I was trying to hide? There's nothing else I can hide, you know? I can just do this. See? see? I wasn't hiding anything. The only thing you see is my OBS. My drawing tablet is my OBS screen. That means the man with Miss May has the key. He's the key. Oh, I get it. What happens to Miss May after that? Uh, anyway, I heard they arrested her. I guess she learned her cr crime won't work anywhere. I was freaking right. I didn't know why I thought Edgeworth. I was freaking, I was fucking right. <laughs> yeah. She pr probably at this time detective client for now. I may have to go down there later. Anyway. This case far from Yes sir. I'm going to find out more about this Do you know do you think he was the one who ah do you think he was the one who maybe so. This don't worry, I'll find him by tomorrow, I promise. I'm counting on you. I was like, I bet you at the end there will be a twin twist that was him. Yeah, true. I asked, I asked for for a full full record of the April May testimony. I thought it might come in handy during trial tomorrow. But now that I have to, uh, but now that I have it, I'm not sure. I'm not so sure. Most of the testimony was all lies. In fact, there's only one part that happening between Stickman from the record. Stickman from the record. May testimony. Oh, May's testimony addressing the victim dodged the attack when running into right and caught in. All right, cool. I don't know how much good this will do for me at all now. Anyway, time to hit prevention and do some investigating. May doesn't may may doesn't belong in that detention 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 center and it's and it's up to me to set her free. To be continued. All right, guys, we'll go for another 15 more minutes. We'll get to the three hour mark and I'll probably end it there. But I probably have enough time to, you know, look in the, uh, look in the investigation. No, yes. Yes. Okay, cool. So we'll do one more. We'll do like an investigation. Set number 7, 13 p.m. Wait the case and then end the stream. Yeah, that might be a good call. Then, yeah. Yeah, probably the best, probably the best call. September 7th p.m., Detective Invading Room. Well, hello. Oh, hmm. I didn't expect anyone to visit me in in such a dank place like this as this. Oh, it's really quite, quite moving. Not. You stinking lawyer, I hope you die. You have, you came here to laugh, yes, laugh at Paul. Fallen Miss May. No, not really. There's something I want to ask you. Unfortunately, there is nothing to be asked. Haven't you done enough questioning, you spiky head? Here we go again. Please, you have... Please, you're scaring this security guy. So, what is it what you wish to ask me? Hmm? You go to gross bag lawyer office? Go to Grish Bag Lewis office. We'll do that in a moment. So, is it this wish you asked me to do then? For starters, how did you get the 
so totally whacked. Hey, guessing, guess what? Actually, I am, I really hate the guts. So I get lost because, well, I'm not comfortable. Thanks, no, I know. Guessing none of this evidence would work. Because I think she does not care at all. So I'm guessing this is not going to be helping me. Alright, so that's fun. Let's just talk to her. That man. What about that man who's staying what, with you in your hotel room? Can you tell me about him? Where is he? Come on. No way, Joes. No way, Joes. John? Hmm. Maybe if I had something to get her to talk. The wiretap? Why did you place the wiretap on this phone? Talk to her. Talking to her is useless? Ah. Really now? Uh, when you, when you said it like. That it sounds like so cold, so so cold, so criminal. <clears throat> Having f people's phones a crime is. Oh, and I'm supposed to learn that in the lawyer school. Hmm? Creep. Woman's impossible to talk to. Return. Say, why is why are you so angry? I mean, you don't look like a bad person. Oh, that does it. What if um. Sucking lawyer, it's cri because it's a criminal. It is a cr crime. Yeah. Bottom. I can tell. Her, doesn't she have thing against lawyers or just against me? <laughs> I think I just touched a nerve. Hey, I guess what? Okay, so you're not gonna. Never mind. Crime. I don't know if she cares, it is a crime. That's a thing. Talk. Yeah, I don't think she's... Can we, like, look at the security guard? This guard motion is motivated to the visit. He hasn't moved an inch. A real pro, this guy. Or maybe he doesn't get to see a lot of women like Miss May in here. That is true. Smile for the camera. What else can we? That's it. Okay. Next space. Well, I'm guessing we can't get any more information out of her. Oh, the off. Look, the painting's missing. September 7th. Garber's lawyer. Garber. Grossberg's lawyer's office. Huh. Looks like the Grossberg is out for the day again. Maybe he avoided me for some reason? Why is this. Why is this missing? This. What is this? An old photo? There's, there are two lying here. Something's being written tense on the back. BL6 exhibit A, BL6 included exhibit B. Let's take a look at B. Hmm? I'm sure that I've seen this person somewhere. Perhaps I borrowed this photo. I'm sure no one will miss just one, this, just this little one photo. Take a zip B. It might be a valuable clue. I'll take it from you. If I lies on the desk, maybe I should switch it with the... I think I'll swap it. I think that's the guy. Saw the marble dead, mahogany death. The painting's missing. Wait a second. Wasn't that giant painting hanging on the wall? Yeah, yeah, it was. A painting of some file. It was the fisherman, right? Wasn't it? Wasn't a very memorable painting. Anyway. No, it was. Sunflower? It's like the fisherman. It looks like a fisherman. I mean, that's it. Yeah, we've already seen everything here. Guessing I'm gonna be. Uh, let's have a look. 
Uh, I'm guessing we're. I guess that we're done investigating here. Go to the hotel. September 7th, Gate, Gatewater Hotel, room 303. Ah, welcome, sir. Quite oh, the performance today, if I dare to say it myself. Oh, um, thanks. Sorry for putting you on the spot like that. No, 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 not at all. Sir. You're effective today, you can only help gate, gateways rip rap, as they say. Huh, rap? Yes. Our responsible will, responsibility was shell as a hotel where murders used to be wiretapped. We can change the permit for room. The permit premium of this room. Of course, it will be great for business. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Miss May hasn't been charged for, with the murder. I, too, will be, become famous. The bellboy who brought the murderer of iced coffee. Why do I feel like we're both stuck in the same bad dream? So you've for our honest guests, please let us let me know if there's anything I can bring you. Yeah, you can actually. Can you tell me who this guy is? Take a photo take this take a look at this photo. That's him. That's him, detective. Huh? I'm a lawyer. Oh, I know that. I just wanted to say detective. You know what it is. Oh, no, I don't. <laughs> Did not. Without a doubt, without a doubt, that's... He was the one in the picture, yeah. Without a doubt, that was a, the man who checked in the with this April May. How about I re written the offense swear, swearing that... Swear that was him. The offender. This guy is way too excited to be... Have him write it. Turn him down. Let him ride it. Well, sure. Why not? Yes. I've always wanted to bring advice, sir. From henceforth, I will be known as the be the bellboy who stole the. Eff <laughs> Just hurry up and ride it. The bellboy is official. Better to cut. Cool. Not even Miss May can play dumb on this. Nice. I'm surprised we couldn't take both photos. Go to the, the de go to the detection deta detention. Yeah, I think I don't know if they won't give me any more clues. That's the problem. I don't think talking to this guy will give me more clues. I think it's this. Yeah, all right, fair enough. I'll talk to him later. You again? Can you take a hint and go? St st uh, hey, the only reason I am back here because you won't won't talk to me. Oh, so mate, so it's my fault now. You don't have any spiky hair, have you? Spiky heart. That doesn't even. That does it. That does it. When this case is done, I'm shaving my head. Don't shave your head, Phoenix. That's not cool. Have you look, have a look at this? Look at. I said several times, I'm not telling you. Uh oh. I think I caught her in the act, everybody. I think we got something. Give me a second, everyone. Let's go again, drink. Give me a second, I'm gonna fill up my, my, uh, one of my em enemies for a moment. I think I showed the bellboy the advice. I think I showed the bellboy the advice. Showed the bellboy advice. I'll do that next time. I should get my enemy. I should really put a stick, I should get like masking tape and just get a sharpie and just a lot of my enemies just on the front there. So you guys just see, like, I think it's a bit, bit of a chuckle. Every time you see, like, oh yeah, that Matt, is pouring the blood of his enemies in his uh, drink bottle. Now I'll show her, show it to her. I'll do it in a moment. Hang on, I'm just getting a drink. Okay, I'll show it to her. 
Where did you? Where did you? Uh oh! I think I caught her in the act. Ah! Here we. Yeah. This is him, isn't it? What? Who? When? Why? Is it him? This is the man who stayed in your hotel room night of the murder. No, no, that's not right. Nice try, Miss Co Cooperative. Do you have proof? Was him? Yeah, proof. Show me proof. So I'm so close. Actually, I do. Is this thing? Could you have? Couldn't you have a, a look at this? What's that? The bellboy's advice. He told us everything he saw, such as the man who's checked in with you. Who was the most definite? This guy. Definitely this guy. Now I'm getting somewhere. Push her. Push her. Head. Irrationate her fear. I'm gonna irrationate her fear. I'm gonna. I'm gonna be the first option. Okay, okay, she's vulnerable now. I should get be gentle. It's May. It would be it would be easier for me to head head this offense to the police. If that's if this gets involved, you would be you wouldn't your boss be even more incorrigible. All I want to do is have here a little chat with him. You won't and you won't tell me. Is that all you have to say? Yes. It's so it's so easy for you to get the police involved. Then why don't you? Why don't you? Somehow I think you're not up to it. Hmm? Somehow I'm. Show me a little kindness, and and they jump all over you. Ah, oh, shrink. Poor little lawyer. And we're we're so close. This wasn't. This wasn't working. I wouldn't. Damn it! Bellboy's avenge was got crazy. This man's photo is still one of them. Why didn't April May not want? No, don't show her. No, show it to her. To think about, he must know him. Shoot. Ah, damn it. Mm. I don't have the I don't have the testimony anymore. Jesus. Did that wrong, Christ. Maybe. Actually, I got an idea. Ah, I think we got something. Someone seems to be enjoying washing the shower. Hmm. The screwdriver is still and stuck in the drawer. I better not touch it. Not telling what the bellboy would do to me. Hmm. I think I'm. I think go to the fat guy lawyer's office. I think so. That makes more sense. Next time I should just. Next time I should have done that. I should have like. You know, whatever. Doesn't matter. I need to find another option. I need to find another vantage point. I need to go. Alright, this is the being ridiculous. Where the heck is that that loaf? Ah home. Ah. That's old familiar clearing the throat. Aha, you again? Hmm. Hello, Mr. Grossberg. Rushbag. Grossberg. Well, well. You're quite the thing, my boy. Excuse me? That trial. The trial. He was there. Remind Remind me to myself when I was, I was a year. I'm guessing something got passed down through the media. 
Maybe. Okay. It brings me back, bring back some memories, doesn't it? Ah, the days, your ma- Oh, the days of my youth. Like the scenes of the fresh, scents of fresh lemon. See? I apologize. I, it was all a bit too much for me, my boy. Seeing you today, well, I, I, I appreciate the remains, but much as rather you gave me some information. Kinda sucks, I can't do the testimony again. Excuse me, I was wondering about this photograph. Where did you get that? Borrowed it. <laughs> well, give it back one, at once. This is Grossberg. Tell me about the man in the photo. He may have been in the hotel room of April May on the night of the murder. Do you know something about him? Anything? Hmm. Um. Very well. I'll tell you what I know. However, you didn't hear it from me. If you follow. You follow? I follow. That man is Mr. Reed White. He's the president of the Blue Corp. Reed White? Hmm. Blue Corp. They something like detective agency, right? They are information pros. They sell information, you see. Surveillance information. Depends on his name, Mr. White. He's the Black Bacchus, Bacchus, Bacchus Respection re question of the country of this man of this country. Yeah, I don't think. I think the fat guy is a lawyer for, at the lawyer's office. Yeah, didn't you r run across him? Which, watch was saying? Would you w want him digging up any dirt on you? Hmm. Selling information sounds like a black sounds like blackmail. Can you tell me where Blue Corp is located? Um, I suppose. Ah, Mr. Reed White at last. Even, even April, April May could have have done it. He, he could have done it. May couldn't have done it. He could have. He could have. Time to ask it. Time to art take action. Photograph returned to Mr. Grossberg. Now I must ask you to leave. I need to think about something alone. Damn it. Damn it, who is? That painting. Mr. Grossberg. Uh, my apologies. I need to think about something alone. He's barely even. Glancing my direction. Your refusal? This is Grossberg. Uh, my apologies, I didn't think about something alone. Okay, so I can't answer any questions, so he's, he's now. Guess I'm gonna go to Blue Corp. Yeah, I'm thinking I'm going to Blue Corp. That's the only way. Look, there's paintings in the background. He knew. Okay, good. He knows. He knows something. In the background, you can tell. What's with this sir of the crowd? Welcome, please. Pleasure me with you, your title, prosecution. What the? What? Your name? What's your name? I was just inquiring, asking the title that you go by. Uh, right. Phoenix, right. Incredible. Wiry. Incredible. Mr. White. Mr. Wright. Isn't it? Right? I see. Is splendid. splendid. Perhaps I have intimidated you with my gentle, my gentlerisk vocabulary. What is this guy's problem? I'm Reed White, CEO of Blue Corp. You know, Corporation of Vigil? He's always right. White? <laughs> He's always white, yeah. A corporation request. Why? My business dealings bring me in contact with a, the Eternal of Eva. I'm so afraid I am not using not used to conversation with worthy challenges. That's what a fruitcake. Hmm. 
Let me guess. You're an attorney, fresh out of law school, are you? That's the only explanation for why you would come to me, come meet me like this. What does he mean that? No matter. So, what business does my lawyer have? I uh, have if a man such as myself. Yep. Yep, this guy is over a meeting of the scale. I have a weird feeling. I have a weird feeling if he used this, he probably can tell me. About this wiretap. Ah, the one of this Miss May. Beast, right? Bad girl, bad girl, bad, bad girl. She testified that she played with this wiretap as your request. How practical. I guess she trying to pass. Dude, but. Bad girl. So, I can't help you. I know nothing. I'm going to need hard evidence to get anything out of this guy. What if I show him the finger? What happens if I show him this? I'm terribly sorry, but this really doesn't seem the correct. Okay, whatever. Hmm. Okay, well, that doesn't work. Oh, you know what would probably help me? That would probably help me. I have an idea. Ah, damn it. I got a plan, right? The photo might be missing, but if I go examine, right? Grab the other photo. Ah, damn it. I can't grab the other photo. Damn it. I have a weird feeling if he, I showed him the other photo, he probably got me on something else, but I guess not. Let's have examine. Why is this painting here? Haven't I seen this before somewhere? Isn't this a relic? Baseball? Ridiculous. I have no interest in anything but the original. That's right. It's a Boma Fade original. Worth five million dollars for sure. But free kill. Hmm. Okay, I'm good. Uh, running up best protection. Judge Kovarev answers specially good try prize. Hmm. There's words judge and specials. Special kind of sorted out. What's up with his desk? I'm guessing this is supposed to be a desk. My my. This is quite a. F quite the thing. It's model of my body, you see. Well, does it speak remote and impressive? Jesus Christ, does it acoustic much? This is just topic for famous story, Bill. The view is quite presidential. Badger man holding up a world. Blue corpse sign comes hands of. Okay, right, well, this doesn't help me out. Help me out. Surely a work of art. I think it's a little too much. If all right, so somehow I had to get it in the act. So, Miss May, Miss May is employee of Blue Corp, is she not? Correct. She was my secretary. What a shocking it was to her, what she has done. What she, oh god, what she has done. You mean the wiretap? Indeed. He is. He is paid to answer the phone. Tapping them is not in our job description. Quote unquote. She doesn't gather information for us, a part of the, her dispute. But I assume we do contain illegal methods. Isn't inquired that she wouldn't do this? Sounds like. Sounds like he's trying to turn Miss May into the suspect. Scapegoat. The night of the murder. On the night of the murder, we were you in April May's hotel room? Who can say? I'm surprised that I'm so in pay intending of the mur murder I decline such as the home of place. Yeah, time to speak. The cookie. Hello, cookie. That my motto is don't worry, be happy. Still, Mr. White. 
the hotel bellboy has it stand on the record that that doesn't remind remember you very clearly. No matter, the bellboy can say whatever place I still won't talk to you. Uh, if you want to want me to speak, put me on the witness stand. Although I doubt you'll be captured for doing that. Hmm. He raises a good point, actually. Why don't the prosecution call him as a witness? He should have seen the same thing as April May. Oh ho ho! The police, the cor courts. To me, they are mere toys, play things for my amusement. That painting. Uh, there's something that being bothering me. Yes. What might that be? A big painting on the wall over there. It's gorgeous. I've seen them before. When did you get it? When did you get it? Say, when did you get that painting? Um, uh, no idea. I forgot. Oh crap. I've been... I've seen that painting before. Yesterday, in fact. Why don't I find out the painting here is today? Mr. Wrong. Mr. Wrong, wasn't it? Right. It's apparent that you, you're not fully grasping your, op your progression here. Ask again, who are you? Who are you again? Uh, a lawyer? No, my fable friend, I'm a mayor. <laughs> Worth nothing. Zip, zoop, zana. Just sorry, excuse of attorney of gross Georgia burger. Wait, what? Ah, uh, oof. Did he just beat me up? Ah, uh, what? Ah, uh, he punched me. He punched me? Well, Mr. Lawyer, what will you do? You do, eh? Change my mind. Change me with assault. Charge me with assault? Charge anyway. I'm what? I welcome it. For you, it's you who will be found guilty. What? He exposed the police. The courts. They will b all do my bidding. So you say. Well, I wonder if this kind of, of control really is possible. I don't expect you to understand. It's... Sorry, I want to be a bit, a bit of a method actor. Understand, it was... It is the word beyond your comprehension. You came here from... Gobby Burger, I pre presume? It's Gro Grossberg, yes? Mr. Grossberg, yes? Then you, you must ask him. Why is it this painting of his hanging here? Perhaps he, then he will tell us. Perhaps he will explain how a man can live life through professional profile. Go on, Chara, there is nothing more to discuss. Ooh, got him with that one. Would you be kind enough to cause the chatting advice to the premium? Let me put this language you can show it under. Shut up and get out. There's nothing more to say. Okay. There you go. Fine. Fine. I will ask him. I'll ask the lawyer man. Alright? What's up with him? Uh, I don't think he's noticed me standing here. Maybe I should uh, clear my throat. Ahem. <laughs> Jumping the trooper. The hoover. Oh, you. What's wrong? You look so red like an old man at the end of his days. Um, I'm not silent yet. I was thinking about this whole thing, whole mess. Nothing really bothers him that much. Clear. Mr. White. So I paid blue cop a visit. Oh, oh, I see. Mr. Grossberg, I have to admit something has been bothering me. Oh, what is that? Well, out with it, my boy. You see, it's just the fo f uh, that photo of Mr. the big that big painting. Mr. Grossberg, sir, there was a giant painting hanging right there in the other day. Where was there not? The one you said you 
had no interest of paint parting with? Well, I saw it today. It was in the CEO of some blue call, Reed White, White office. So, you notice. I suppose to have, I suppose, supported, I should have have guessed you wouldn't, was, is a large painting. Mr. Kroesberg, I know you, I, I know you and Mr. White are connected somehow. Correct, you say. Yes, and I know what it is. He given, he's given you information. He's blackmailing you. Your lovers. <laughs> oh my god, it'd be funny if I did your lovers. No, it'd be funny if I said that. No, he's blackmailing you. Makes sense. He's giving you information? No, he's blackmailing you, bro. It's the way. Has something on... Does he blackmail? Is it blackmail? Ah, I've got it. I got him. I think the painting is very group... Great profit. Proof. Very well. This may be the change I've been waiting for. Maybe it's time to get this off my chest so I can finally rest easy. After all, you when they, they understand perhaps it was fate. What are you talking about? Reed White is a man who makes his life through intimidation. Blue Corp is a company that ex excludes in finding people, finding weaknesses. I'm afraid, finding people's weaknesses. I'm afraid. I've been paying them for 15 years now. 15 years? Jesus. All because of the DL, DL6 exclusive, as you may have guessed. The, the name on the back of the photograph. As opposed to, I could not stand defense of May because of this. White, uh, White would have destroyed me if I did. So, the, so that it's so connected. So they're connected. It is here for me to tell you this, my boy. But erasing Reed, arresting a Reed Wright will be the night of the night, night or uh, impossible. Impossible? Why? He's information on everyone. I've it's given me, given him the, an iron grip. He owns, he owns the judge, the attorney, the prosecution, the police, and the politic. What? They, they are bound unbelievable to do, do harm themselves. Those fo, those, these foes to him. Don't look at, don't look at me out like that. What, why? Why is that? Okay, whatever. Uh, okay, fair enough. Uh, what do you see is something more than wait for many years? Trials today, today's trial, you're refused. Reasons for blackmail. But why were you blackmailed over this? The DLC incident was top secret at the It was, um, it's made sense that the police didn't want to people to know they were using, using a medium. They couldn't let people know. But one person found out. I, I told him. He told White. He offend, offended me rich. He offend me rich. I can't say that right. Eh, can't even speak to it. Is in, em, it is embarrassing to me now. Because I talked, the police were mocking far and wide. It's in secret, they bring looking for the one who sold them out. Of course, White heard about it and he came to me. me. Only to this time, a third was blackmailed. I see. White controls the law of the country as he sees fit. Yet if, if you would still change him, challenge him, he could close look at May, mayor officer, May officer. I don't mind aim watching my childhood video game. Childhood videos. Yeah, don't mind me. I am watching my childhood videos. All good, man. Don't worry about it. Maya's office? She followed his every move for you. He may have recorded something 
of what she found. Today's trial? So you came to see today's trial? Yes, I did. Something was bothering me all the, at least the night. See, so could get a wink of sleep. Really? What was that? Well, you see, it's just my, 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 uh, my sister, my sister, the poor girl, my boy, I owe you a, f a thank thanks truly. I don't know what I would have done if things had gone poorly for you. Where's the, where's the DL6 incident? DLC is nothing more than some sort of code for police to give the case. It was 15 years ago now. I received a request from a me medium as spirit medium. Medium? Her name was M May Misty Free. Free? Indeed. He was M Maya's mother. He had came increasingly of a murder at the by quest from the police. And she failed. As a result, the police called her a fraud. I knew it. This is what Maya was talking about the other day. She had she had a big she had a big secret, yeah. Of course she did. I did I did all I could for her. And in the end, cleaning her was war wrongdoing. The murder case however remained unsolved to today. That case is the DL6. I was asking before, but why did you refuse to help? I think I have already know a right. A right with right. No, no, I'm sorry. I just need more time to out my. He doesn't seem terrible about that. Okay, fair enough. Uh, well, he, uh, well, we got all the information I can get getting out of him, so. I think that's what I wonder if I show him this. Sorry, my boy. I don't have to think. Okay, whatever. Well, that's go get go to sleep. I'll go to sleep in a moment. I just want to figure this out. Um, uh, I gotta move. It's funny. It looks like at the room. This room. It seems so normal. I do imagine a murder took. Here. Mr. Crossbait said there would be would be a clue. Maybe I should have a, another look. Oh, look around. No, I have to sleep. Oh, okay, right here. See you, man. All those cases cases achieved even worked. Yeah, I feel like all. Oh, take a look. What this should I look at? Ah, oh, damn it. What was that thing again? They. D6, right? A, B, C, D. B, C, D, H, I, like, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, A, L. Let's, look, let's see. J through S. Nothing much here. Maybe it'll just get through this. Die. Well, I'm you know flipping through a bit of the guess. Big part of here is the end of S of S suicide. You said she collected a suicide report? There's always a policeman. Written on the most of the in pencil. What? This is media handwriting. Maya's handwriting. Wait, get it. Maya thought he was the involved the suicide. I drove them all. You can use this new scrap as a Hmm. Let's find more. Nice. Nice. So, wait, what else can we do? Second. A to I. Let's see it from A. Uh, A, B, T, F, G. A, Mystery May. This May. Mother. Hmm. Should I take a look? Yeah, read it. Whatever. And, uh, word for lovers, 
a German came to find who he does. One of one made of my mother blamed herself herself this let's how ruined my family. I had this I finally I named two men one man is Marvin Gro Grossberg. The lawyer sold my mother information. The other man sold the information at the cost. Present that makes this person parasite who make the fo the founder truths correction. His name is hmm. The record stopped there. So Mayor Hugh Grossberg. Ah yes. Maybe some more information we're missing here. Easy. I know, white. Ha, that's it. There's an entry with W selection is missing. It was taken. Ah, okay, so the thing was taken. Good to know, good to know. So we know it's been taken. Okay, it seems like he's more calmed down now. Uh, found this in Maze's files. So she's written in soon reads white as expected. Well, well, if we want to chain challenge him, you could present this in court. Not a bad idea. Hmm. Well, I've already talked to him, so... Ah, oh, I don't want to go back to this guy again. He's annoying. Well, ain't you persistent? Sorry, but there's something I have to ask. It's the lawyer. I really ha hate having to beat myself. But it seems the message has not yet been to track. Skull, stop bothering me. You try to pretend the feather. I fear I have nasty freedom. Don't make myself. Do I make myself good? transparent? Miss May, I think we're a part of talking about Miss May. Got a, this guy on the spot. Quick. Hmm. What's the matter? You seem distressed. I can't answer any more questions. Oh, I wasn't really, uh, less than you, you him out. Okay, whatever. What happens when I do this? This is the only clue I have in my life. I better not. So what, see this? Oh my god, it's my first Minecraft house. <laughs> Isn't an artifact your suicide? He's embarrassed secret government funds. Then one day... Wouldn't you got the press? The very next day you took his own life. And the coroner me how? I found the article in Miss May. He has filled files with art analytics like this. Everyone of them labeled with a sign with white. Uh oh, I think I got Do you want me to show my first house in creative mode? Yeah, go ahead. Mr. White, I know what that was. Mr. White, I know that you did. You bought. You bribed him. You spied him on him. You blackmailed him. You did to the po politician. I don't think you bribed him. You blackmailed him. That makes more sense. You blackmailed him. You blackmailed him. Blackmail. No, just him. Evil, you were threatening or cursing hundreds of others. You're involved in all of this suicide case that Maya is in this game. This company is built on black. This company is built on blackmail. Am I right, ain't I? What a bizarre occasion. What if that was should be doing now, investigating me? No, no, no. I think not. You shouldn't be searching for the one who killed Miss Naya. 
Secret office, hello. Mr. Wrong, will you... We'll be leaving now. Yes, sir. I will send someone right away. Wait, seconds. Right. You're right. You're wrong. You're wrong. You're wrong, Mr. White. Excuse me? What should I do be doing now is going after you. That's what are you increasing? Maya was on you, onto you. She was keeping tabs. For the reason you, you had April met, April tapped her phone. Then Maya was the, Maya wasn't the, was, was murdered and all documents about your mysterious d disappearance. So there's a clip room clipping would be every every a child could work it out, Mr. White. You did it. Be secret office. He won't be needing an escort. Well, Mr. Wrong, including please contact can connect me to public. Professional office? Of course, sir. One moment. White, that's, that's you. What are you doing calling me at this time? Hello, Chief Prosecution. I've changed my mind. I want to testify tomorrow. What? This, what's this about? This is for the May Quarry case. I witnessed the murder, see? And those... As a very important witness, I would like to testify. What? Why not? Why now? I thought you said you didn't want to be to go to court. Right, I told you I changed my mind, didn't I? And one of other thing, send the police over here right now, right away. This man is standing right in front of me, in front of me, and he looks dazed and but could be violent. What? What do you mean? Are you even listening? Exchange the haters, the man, location, the killer, the, the man. What? The wide isn't it enough? Another one of these. Those chief prosecution, prosecutor. I do not believe you are in position to f really offer opinion to me correctly. I'm telling you to send a, the police. I did not. I did not tell you the wrong. You are a main a mayor, mayor lawyer. I as w was was Miss. How dare you! I point a finger at, at you, and you will you will try as Miss May's killer. In this case, the case is is a good as settled. No lawyers or any worth will defend you. I have a friend in the local lawyer association. See, you'll be given a you'll be given a lawyer. So splendid, make even you look completely. I feel. Detective Gumshoe reporting, sir. Oh, what the hell? Ah, Buzz. Buzz, Harry Buzz. Buzz. Ryan, actually Phoenix, right? And my friend name is Larry. Oh, right. Sorry, pal. Buzz was the murderer, right? Detective Gumshoe. I present you to the man who killed Miss May Fry. What? Take him can't human become the custody. Very well, Mr. Wrong. Oh, you're going down. You are, you are going down. Let me just crack my nut. I can't believe it's only been a day since the first trial. The trial begins tomorrow. White is going to set a trap. You gotta set up a trap for me. And prosecution will be in on, on it. Whilst Edgeworth included. The attorney was assigned to me, but the state yesterday. I refused. I had I had an idea. I have an idea. Right? Mr. White. Oh, Maya. Great. They let you out of the tension. Just now. Just, just now, yes. It's all thanks to you. 
Now, now I'm afraid with which places. Place. What do you mean? I excluded what had to happen to me. I didn't believe it. How many people does this man need to destroy before he satisfied my mother, my sister, and now you? This has to go. This has gone too far. Mr. Riot, please tell me, is there anything I can do? Um, well, defend me in court. She, he, cheer me, cheer on in court. Help me break out of here. <laughs> oh, should I, should I defend her? I think we should ask her to defend me in court. She's the only one who knows this stuff. She knows the thing. She's a medium. She probably can help. Cheer me on, on in the Send me in court. In court. All right. Can you can you be my defense lawyer tomorrow? All right. Oh god. Uh, leave it to me. I'm Miss May. After all, lawyership runs in our blood. Wasn't the ghost power that ran your blood? I better run to the book sh bookstore. I pick up some copies of Law and Laws for Rookies. Here we go. Wait, what? Wait, 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 wait. What, what, what? I'm kidding. I was a, I was a, it was a joke. No way. No, 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 really. I was kidding, but thanks. Okay, wait. Now, what's this? What's this, Carl? Okay, I had no clue what the hell that is. Um. Okay, don't know what the hell that is, but I'll look at it later. And, oh, what time is it anyway? I mean, three and a half hours, Jesus. But, but I can't sit here and do nothing. I've got to give that man a piece of my mind. Just a piece? Okay. Then come to the trial tomorrow. Oh, okay. I'll be there. I'll show them a thing or two. Science may have changed, but yet with crime, it is the same old story. In fact, I'm gonna. In fact, it's gonna work. Worse late for progress as long as we. Did. Two years ago. At limit three days, I put finish call. Second, everybody. Second. Well, t exists exist five years ago. Yeah, of course it did. I never thought I would end up in the defense chair myself for this case. With the true corporate appearing as Star witness. This is this is it. Tomorrow it's me or him. Well bring it on, my friend. To be continued. Alright, everyone. Alright, I don't want to be that guy, but I think Alright everyone, I don't want to be that guy, but I think this might be the time I should end the stream. Um <laughs> So, I hope you guys enjoyed Phoenix Wright turning at law. I think it'd be a good time to stop. No, finish it. Ah, oh, do I have to finish it? I don't want to, I don't want to go on for... I want to end it, but... Alright, whatever, we'll finish it. Fine, we'll finish it. Alright, fine, we'll do one more. That's what, that's what I'm waiting for. Fine, we'll finish it. September 9th, 9, 9.52 a.m. Fence lot. Well, I guess this is it. Yeah. Come on, for Hang on, guys. Yay, thanks. You're welcome. One way or another, this case is getting started today. Ah. Phoenix? Look. What the... Prosecutor Edworth? 
I received a call from the chief prosecutor's office yesterday. I was told whatever Mr. White say, hey, it will be the abolished truth, of course. No matter how you try to attack the testimony. If I raise an objection, I have good faith that judge will listen to me. What does what does White have to judge it judge in his pocket too? So you're just saying you're going to be guilty at, at the end of the story. I will do anything to get my advice, Mr. White. Anything. Why? Why? How can you testimony as in, in close with this person like this? Incorrect. How can we know that? As guilty will always lie to avoid being found out. There's no way to tell who's guilty and who's innocent. Yeah, he's clearly guilty. All of these can hope to do the, is getting even defense checked guilty. So I made that my policy. Edgeworth, you've changed. You've changed. Huh? Phoenix? You know him? I didn't expect any special treatment, Phoenix. Ah, uh, Phoenix, right? Phoenix? Well, count to count. Uh, well, court will be starting soon. What? But wait. Your defense attorney is even here yet? They're not. They're not. I'll be defending myself. What? Okay, let's do this. Wow, what a cha what a Chad move! God damn, what a move! He's defending himself. What a, what a baller! God damn, let me get let me just get it tomorrow. What a Chad move, dude! He's defending himself. Dude, what a boss! Give me a second, everyone. Just good. Yeah, that's better. I wonder where all my light was. What well, is now in section for the trial of Phoenix Wright? Prosecution is ready, Your Honor. The defense is ready, Your Honor. Mr. Wright, are you sure you're up to for doing this? Yes, Your Honor. I'll be defending myself. Understood. Very well, Mr. Edgeworth. You're I'll print in statement, please. As, as the tent tell that, ah, damn it, tell of the events are already quite clear to the court. They will hear, will, they, we will hear the testimony of the witness to the defense crime. Tell me of the crime. I see. Prosecution may call it. That went too, that went far too smooth. Why didn't the judge ask Edgeworth why his witness didn't testify before? It's like... Like, he already knows why. Hmm. Is anyone going to raise objection about this? I suppose it's supposed to be... Let it go? No, Carl's don't. Raise an objection, dude. You need to know. Edgeworth, your own explanation of the court. Why didn't you? Why didn't the witness testify in the trial agent of Miss May Fry? Huh. I'm, I'm very even sorry. For, very sorry, Mister White. It's bit is a busy man, and besides, at the time those Miss Miss May obtained was all the word be needed. Again, since. Sincerely, my apologies to the court. Excellent, Mr. Edgeworth. It appears it was a thing. Oh, you're lagging? Oh, I'm sorry, man. Uh, Edgeworth, are you being such a great? He's getting a show off. I get nowhere. Now, uh how? -huh. Now, here, I would like to call Mr. Reed White to the stand.
Please state your full name. You wish to know the title of my profession? Ah, your name. Yes, that's that. That is what it, I said. Oh dear. Oh my. Lo location confusion. Name. These two are great together. <laughs> These two are great together. My name is Reed White, but my friends call me Biocro Necro. Oh Jesus Christ. Neo. I am the CEO of the, or the more committed terms, president of Blue Corp. Do you know the victim, Miss Mayfry? That would be negotiable. No, I did not. Bull crap. You were the Gatewater Hotel at the night of the murder? Correct. And the, your witness, the, and you witnessed the murder from there? Um, well, I'll tell you what I already know. Very well, Mr. White. You can begin your testimony. If I can, if I can't rip this guy testimony apart, I'm done. Why do I always feel like the end of the en the end of the world, and I'm the last man standing? Oh ho ho! Oh my God, this guy! I hope you have made a your peace with your God, Mister. Let him have it. Finn. Let's see, I was about, it was about 9 o'clock, I believe. I was quite, uh, quite confirmed, uh, they're reading to your, some papers by the window. There was no papers by the window. Then I heard the bed of him come from outside. Surprise, I truly, I turned, I turned out to look at the building across the way. It was then I saw him. Saw him. A spooky hand man attacked a woman with a long with long hair. Okay. Needless to say, the man was none other than you, Mr. Lawyer. I called Miss May over at once. She saw to saw was because of course. The victim, she she ran away. She ain't ran away, but your grave cheese. Finally, there was a terrible impact, then it was all over. He's lying. Hmm. This thing's a correction of testify. Your testif testify. Then I'm afraid the defense is guilty. Very well, defendant. Uh, I mean, Mr. Wyatt. Your cross examination? Yes, Your Honor. Let's see. It was about nine o'clock, I believe. Nine o'clock. When the murder start? Okay. Good. About nine o'clock, I believe. All right. Let's see. Because the murder started at 9 o'clock, right? He couldn't have seen it. There was only one person through that window. He couldn't have seen it. There's only one person that was looking through that window. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Oh, for God's sake, now I'm going to do it by myself. I was uh, quest preferring, uh that r reading to your some... Don't press it. Don't press it. Ah. Ah, I really want to press it. Really want to press the Q button. Really do. Because that's not true. There was no papers near the window. I mean press. I mean press. Don't press it. I mean press. Ah, God damn it. I just want to throw it in his smug face because no, no papers.
Just next to see. Want to see? Okay, fine. Then I heard a bed alarm. Bed la bedlin come av come a bad badlin but badlin bedlin bed alarm coming from outside. Surprise! I turned out to look at the building across the way. There was only one person in the building. It was. I saw him. A spiky haired man attacking a woman with long hair. Needless to say, that man was none other than Mr. Lawyer. I called Miss May over at once. She to she too was surprised, of course. The victim she she ran away, but you gave you gave chase. Fine, there was a terrible impact, then I was all over. I really want to press him on one thing. One thing is he couldn't have seen it. Two there was one thing that kind of messed up. I think you should press him on the... I think the one where he gave chase? I think so. Chase. Can you be a little more detailed about that? I think it was worth knowing exclusively what happened. Of course. I understand. The victim was attacked by you and ran to the left. That's wrong. Remember what she said. She ran to the right. Maybe she went to the right. Remember? You gave chase and struck her down. Are you sure? As you know, I am always absolutely perfect. Perhaps you could change your testimony to refer to the new detail. The victim. Yeah, she said the right. She ran right. That's the problem. The victim ran to the left. No, that's wrong. Cause you. She said she ran to the right. The victim dodged an attack and ran to the right, but she was caught. Thing. She ran to the right. This is the evidence we needed. This will tell him that's not true. Right? Because she saw it. He may have told lies for the testimony, but she saw it. He didn't. From his angle, he saw he, she went left. His left. So her right. Objection! Wait right there. It's white. You've dragged your... Own, you dug your own grave. What is this? You said the victim ran to the left. But Detective Conson, Miss, you're still alive. Yeah, I'm still alive. May, this May's testimony. She clearly started st stared at the victim ran to the right. Oh, uh, <laughs> it's simple. You have Miss. I misheard her. I think not. Look at the floor plan. The killer were, was, was here. And the victim was here. If the victim ran to the right, to her left, as claimed she did, she wouldn't have been running directly away from the door. She would be, have to be running into a, into a dead end. Don't you find that odd? <laughs> Very strange. I did see her run to the left, I did. I'd seen her run to the left. Phoenix, look at his face. I don't think he's lying about this one. No, he's definitely lying about this. True. Maybe he, maybe he really did see the victim run left. Because he was in there. So he... So he did witness the killing. He did witness the killing. Wait a second. Mr. Wright? 
Yes, Your Honor. This may say right, and Miss White said left. Can you explain this to the court? Mr. White was right. Miss May is right. Both are right. No, both of them are right. No, 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 no. Miss May is right. He saw it on the left because he's the killer. He did. So, he's right. Mr. White is right. He moved, she moved to the right. He, he moved to the left. Yes, because think about it. If you're facing somewhere, right, if I, let's say, going, if I'm facing the camera, right, where did that go? Let's say this is the window. So saw through the window, right? If I'm staring this way, you guys are facing that way, right? So this is my right hand. So if I move left, it looks like I'm moving it right. So he's right. So if he was moving left, he saw it right. So he's right. Mr. White is right. He do both both are right. Yeah, both are right. Yeah. Both witnesses are telling the truth for once. Ha, huh, I doubt it. Rather that doesn't not clear up the conversation. Do both are right? Yeah. There's no s what explained there. The confusion of the count. What? Obviously, then the witness was not viewing the c crime from the hotel. Where did the story come from? Mr. Wright, what do you mean? Yes, what do you mean? He was not viewing the crime from the hotel. If he was not in the hotel, where could he be? be? In the lawyer's office, of, co of course. Ah. <laughs> Was a spectacle. He was standing here. He was standing here. Time of the showing the court. The court. Oh, right. So the kill's here, right? If you move left, so. Take that. That's where he was. No wait, Mr. Wright. We are not fools. You couldn't have exactly where the victim was standing. Oh, right. It's a right. What is that meaning of this? Sorry, Rona. Let me try again. Time to show the court what. Take that! This is where, the, where he was. Look, if the victim ran from the door, if he was watching from the point of him wondering or perched that she ran to the left. Please, there is no time for jokes and little tips. There is where, where is the killer was standing. Order, I will have order. Any disturbance in the order of the courtroom will be... Held a comp. Mr. Wright, where are you suggest? What do you suggest? Responsibility? Objection. The prosecution of the defendant are distraught of the truth, Your Honor. Indeed, they do not seem to be a fetch fit. Oh, ha uh, You prove us with so much entertainment, Mr. What now? He's. Laughing? The hilarity of the moment made me remember something. I appeared I have been unclear, unclear and for well, this I apologize. Mr. Your Honor, might I be allowed to testify once more? Very well. Let us hear your reversed, revised testimony. Good luck. You can't fix a broken testimony, buddy. Miss May's testimony was correct, as was mine. Yeah, that's true. When I assumed the girl was, she was eh. when I assumed the girl, she was first ran to the left. Mister Your Honor, yeah. 
and then you hit her savagely that what I saw. Next with the lot lost the strength he ran to the right. How'd you move left to the right? That makes no sense. He chased her delivery in the final blow. Well, Judge has an impressive beard. Yes, he does. The final blow. That is what when Miss May saw. See? You hit her twice. No, she hit once. That's the thing. That makes no sense. That's the problem, right? I have the notes. Alright, hang on. Let's have a look. Is that from a blow? A blow. A blow. By a blunt object. May have lived for several minutes after being hit. Hit. A blow. That means one, right? It means you have to hit once. He said twice. There's no way, no way you can hit him twice if you go left and right. Been hit once. For several minutes, yes. She's been hit once, not twice. That seems to make sense. Well, be you cross examine the witness testimony? You bet I will. I mean, yes, Your Honor. He ran to the left. Quote unquote. This May's testimony was correct, as as was mine. When I assaulted assaulted the girl, she first when you assaulted the girl, the girl she first ran to the left. And then you hit her savagely with that that's what I saw. Next next uh with the last of her strength she ran to the right. Chase her delivering the final blow. That's what Miss May saw. You see, you hit her twice. That's the thing. We didn't hit her twice. If that's the case, you hit her once. It, it doesn't say when did he see once? That's what I mean. Right? Thing didn't say twice. It said a a blow, meaning one. Objection! Mr. White. The victim died before from a single blow. What do you have to say to say to that? Uh uh now my ch chance to hit him where it counts. Mr. White, wasn't it you who told the court you were absolute absolutely perfect? Mm. I will refrain from using that phrase from now on. Your Honor, if you could ask the witness for a new testimony. Objection! The witness is obviously confused, Your Honor. I would like to request a 10 minute break. Yes, yes, quiet. Objection! The witness is confused because he's lying. The Imbra request that there be no break, Your Honor. Yeah, we'll... Yeah, we'll adjust it. Don't let him get away. Ooh, jeez, here we go. Here we go, now we're cooking with fire. Very well. If the witness would... Care to reveal reveal his testimony? The coward on the crowd is on my side. No stepping out of this now, White, Mr. White. Oh, okay. Ah, oh, he's now pouting. Ah, uh, well, see, look at the other window when I heard that thing fell. Wait, what? Uh, well, see, I looked at the other window when I heard that thing fell. Then the, the moment I saw Miss May ran into the left. The killer you attacked her. The kill. The killer you attacked her, but she dodged. Okay. Um, and then she turned and ran for the door. Then you did her, didn't, then you did her, her in with a single blow. Womp. Hmm. 
Bump, indeed. Very well. You may bring your cross examination. Your Honor. My stomach, you are. it hurts. Deal with it. This is almost over. Ah. Okay. Uh, well, very well. Look, look. I look. I looked at the other window when I heard that thing fell. What thing? Try pressing the thing fell. Yeah, I was about to say that sounds really shit. Really sus. Hold it. You heard it, that thing fell? What? What exactly do you think? What that thing? Uh oh oh that um the glass light stand. How do you know about a glass light stand? There's no way he knew about that. If he was in the other room, he wouldn't have heard that. Well, you may you can, but I don't think he would have heard that from where he's standing. Right, the one that had fallen over at the scene. Phoenix doesn't seem about this. That strikes you as odd. Yeah, it's very odd. Yeah, that's that is odd. I'll press further. Mr. White. Huh? What? You're saying you saw the glass light stand? Yes. Then chance then change your testimony to refer refer reverse that. Sorry, my bad. The witness will reverse his testimony. Okay, of course. The light stand was laying on the floor when I looked. When I looked. How could he see it? He was how did he see the glass light shard? Light stand. A light I a light stand was laying on the floor when I looked. How did he see it? He was in the other apartment. That makes no sense. Then the next moment I saw Miss Mage ran to the left. Kill you attacked her, but she dodged. I really want to press him on that. <laughs> but her, do I want her, I want him, I want to get rid of those dots because I have a weird thing. The killer you attacked. You did? Did he see it by the window? It's impossible. There's no way he saw it from the window. The problem is, right? If we look at the picture, right? Let's have a look at the picture, right? So let's see. The only thing he could he couldn't see it at all. The only thing he could have saw this was in the corner, right? If he was looking through here, he wouldn't have seen it fall. He wouldn't. He probably heard it, right? He probably heard it, but he wouldn't have seen it fall. You can see here. There's covers here that he couldn't. No one could have seen from that motel, whatever angle. That's the thing. So, Kyle, you're right. It's impossible. He couldn't have seen. Well, he did say laying on the floor, but how the hell did he see that? I would. Oh, I gotta press him on it. There's no way. The broken remains of the glass was broken behind, behind all registration. He would have seen the glass pieces, but he couldn't identify the glass. Light stand. No, that's true. Because that's the thing. Yeah, he wouldn't have seen the glass. He would have seen the glass pieces, but he couldn't. He couldn't. He can't identify the glass light. No, because I think the floor pan makes more sense. If I do the floor pan, he may. Objection! Mr. White, it's impossible for you to have seen the glass stand. What? Look at this. The, the, uh, there are a, this is the floor plan to the scene of the murder, yes? Correct, Your Honor. Now look. If you were looking through the window of the office, this area, you, in this area, in the area, you wouldn't be able to see. Here. Well. Note the stand, stand is not within the vi vi visible area. Well, Mr. White, what do you know? Ha what do you have? What do you have to say to that? 
uh, uh, ridiculous. Mr. White, if you were in the Gatewater Hotel, as you claim, you couldn't have seen the stand before it fell. In fact, you wouldn't have to be, you'd be able to see it after it fell either. There's no way you could have recognized the broken shard as glass, as a glass light stand. So, <coughs> so when did you see the stand, Mr. White? It must, it must have been the moment that it fell, and the only place you could have seen it from inside is inside the fair flare office. In other words, you were at the scene of the crime when the murder took place. <laughs> oh god, he's mad. Oh, he's angry. We got him now, boys. Everybody, I think we got him. Mr. White. Everyone, I believe we got him. Mr. White. Mr. White. You did it. Didn't you? Your, Mr. Your Honor, I, I, this may. <laughs> he looks like he's about to go, get out on a regret. That's fair enough, Phoenix Wright. What? Ah, I forgot about Edgeworth, Mr. White. I think this time to come has come. Shouldn't you confess your crime now, hmm? What? I said you should confess your crime. Ego. Confront that you... Your place that was wiretapped. 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 Oh great, now order, order. Mr. Edgeworth, explain to the court what you mean by this. Discharge members of the court. Discharge members of the court. Mr. White is slightly confused. Allow me to explain. I really know. I really don't know. I really don't like the way this. This way this ahead. As you know, Mr. White is the CEO of Blue Corp. He ordered the security, Miss April May, ta to tap the law office of Miss Fry. Free. What does that have to do? Your Honor, the question is, where was the wiretap placed in the office, and by who? No, you wouldn't. Mr. White, in order to place the wiretap, you entered Miss Frey's office. Am I correct? Correct. Oh god. You're, you're correct. You're most correct, Miles. Give me a break. Yes, in order to place the wire tower, I had to breach into Fair Office Lake. This is when I saw the acu accused last stand. Oh, great. Oh, God, here we go again. Now I'm confused. Please explain to the court what all this means, Mr. Edgeworth. Gladly, Your Honor. Mr. Phoenix Wright has made its provision quite clear. He has the man that Mr. White knew the glass stand was in the office. He showed that... God damn it, he showed that... That there was only one time Mr. White could have seen, it, seen the stand. At the very moment of the murder. Those Mr. White... Those... The, the, uh, first Mr. White, you would like to believe that Mr. White... Was the, murder, was the murderer, I see. However, it is a fact that Mr. White has been to that office, ah, office well before the murder took place. When he w went to the place to do the wiretap, he couldn't have seen the glass like the glass light stand then. There you go, Mr. Phoenix Wright's theory result of blessing of co Oh, for God's sake. Oh, my God. Mr. White, you will testify to the court about this wiretap. Uh-huh. Leave it to me. Oh, God. Here we go. I feel faint. 
Great. The true boss fight has begun. It was the beginning of the September this week, before the murder. I've entered the Feb and Co. Law Office. Of course, I had done some to... I've done some to place the wire chat. He's the CEO. When will he ever go do this? This is when I saw this glass light shade. Hmm. So, you saw the stand before the night of the incident. And this is how, this is how sh you should able to identify what had fallen over by, by, by the sound. Oh, correct. That's right. I see. Very well. Mr. Wright, you can cross-examinate. God, what am I supposed to do now? Good luck, Phoenix. Oh, thanks. Press every statement. Press every... I can't do every statement. Because they're all lies. That is true. That is true. They're all lies. It was the beginning of September. This week before the murder. That's not true. If that was the case... It, department, department store receipt with letters... Blood. Oh, Jesus. Because they're all lies. They are all lies, right? That's the problem. I ha have entered the Fair Co. Law Office. Of course I had done some, so press, press not press, press is dangerous. <sighs> yeah, I know, is the dangerous? Yeah, I know it is. But, don't present, presenting is dangerous? I know it is, I have to press him on something. I can pressure him into something though. No, he's a CEO. Hold it, hang on. Hold it. Why did the, you tap Maya's phone? Objection. There is no being on the court current chase, Judge. No. We call up detect agents of sorts. We have the responsibility to protect our clients' confidentiality. Wait, this makes no sense. I'm gonna press him with this. Hold it. You have proof. Objection. Mr. April May knew the details of Miss Fred's phone conversation. This proves that the wiretap was placed before the murder. Ah, right. Of course I've done this, so the place to wiretap. This is when I saw the glass light stand. Hold it! Why did I notice something as inclusive as a light stand? The light stand was made of entire of glass. It was quite stylish, so I guess I made a list of things, such as a dispatch thing, the serve attorney, doesn't it? This is it. That's it. That, that is all. Damn it. There's nothing there for me to press him on. Oh well. Maybe I rather enough that I can bluff something out of him. Hmm. No, wait, 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 wait. If that was the case, of course I had done the wiretap. What we can do. Now, this is going to be extremely dangerous, but extremely ballsy, right? This might be the wire tap. Dude, just try to say what I said, said please. Just try pressing everything. I think, I think it'll work. I gotta do it. Listen, this is the only way I can think of it. If that's the case, this might be the way to do it. You just try what 
I said before. Just press everything. I think everything will work. I think it will work. Ah, damn it. Ah. Uh, uh, all right, whatever. I'm going to do it. Ah, damn it. I'm going to mess this up. Objection! Your Honor, that statement contains this evidence. Evidence. Hmm? It does? It doesn't seem anything concerning. Ah, uh, really? Objection overruled. Try to think before making a suit, right? Ah, oh, for God's sake. Oops. Didn't go so well. Ah, oh, man. If I try everything right, that's the problem. I can't hold him out on it. When I saw the last light stand, gotta bluff him in. Trust me. Oh my god, this is gonna be really bad, really quick. For God's sake. I would trust you. That's the problem, right? The thing is, it's just hard. The broken remains of the glass light stand. Objection! Your Honor, that statement correct. And it does. Can't do everything. I have. I had to think smart about this. Gotta bluff him into us. Wait a minute. There's no other choice. There's no other choice. There is a choice. Wait a minute. No, wait. September? Hang on a moment. Hold it! Objection! Wait, 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 wait. There is a way we can figure this out. Check this out. I know this sounds really stupid, but I got an idea. But, it's not this one. All I understand... There is a choice. In there somewhere. Trust me. Uh... Objection! With the statement clearly... Faulty, Your Honor. Ah, I figured it out. I'm sorry, but I can't see nothing. Nothing. Are you kidding me? Unfortunately, I will have to. Are you kidding me? Ah, I must be. Greg, this. Ah, there must be a way. This disc, disc. Damn it! There's nothing there for me to press him on. Oh, maybe battling enough that can blast something out of him. Hey, Georgie. Wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. That's the case. Office. Can't do everything because that's the problem. Damn it. Objection! Oh, for God's sake. That's the thing, right? <sighs> I'm back from school. Nice. Just try the mercenary and the story.
try to press everything. What's everything? I don't get that. I I can't. <sighs> what do you mean by press everything? Objection! Oh, press Q. Oh. You know, <sighs> Hang on. Not. Hang on, give me a second, let me try it again. Press Q. Wait. Oh, I select save. Alright. Back to this again. Seriously, I wanted to just go to bed right now. Hang on a second, everybody. Yeah, 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 yeah. We've been through this before. Just give me to the... Testimony. Yeah, 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 we've been through this before. I'm just too tired for this. I really want to stop and get, get some sleep. So I really want to finish this call, but I have really good suggestion here. I would love to do this next time. But this is going to take us long enough. It's going to take us to like 1 o'clock and then I don't... Listen, I would... Listen, I do want to continue going with this, but I have a weird feeling I'm going to... I don't want to be longer than I want to, so I'm going to end it here. Right? Just because I think it's a good idea. To trust me? Dude, when you say press everything, right? It's kind of hard saying press everything and present everything, okay? When you press everything, I, meant, I thought you meant every evidence, okay? I didn't... forgot there was a press button. Right? I do trust you, I just didn't know what you meant. Listen, I don't want to get angry about this. Don't worry about it. Listen, I should have trusted you. You should have said press, right? I forgot that was the press button. I thought you meant press. <sighs> don't want to get mad. Don't worry about it. My bad. My B. So, yeah. I just don't want to get into it now because I'm too tired to care. Because I'm not supposed to be up this late. <laughs> for me, for my age. Well, yeah. Yeah, I know. Trust me, I'll do it next time. Bail. Bye. Yeah, bye, guys. I'm gonna go. Talk to you guys later. Bye bye. See you guys later. Bye. Talk to you guys tomorrow. But well, we'll remember it for tomorrow. I will remember it next time. I won't remember it tomorrow, but I'll remember the next time to press him every time. Press every time, because that doesn't take presenting. Okay? Fair enough. All right, everyone. I'll talk to you all next time. I'm not mad. No, no. Don't worry. Okay, good. All right, guys. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.